Never mind me while I'm stepping out my circumference. I feel the nerves trickling down. It's life humbling. My words start a stumbling, staggered on court of God. This the life of a jiggle boot introverted on scarred. Whoa, my mother been the melodies while they sing the choruses. Direct messages from slaves saying we need more of it. Paranoia in my state. I see envy at high rates. Now it's crop off the fate. Turn great, so I fly straight. Was gone for a minute. Now I'm back like an ex with big factors. I see you turn flat like an extinct, like some raptors. When I drop food prayer purposes and practice and patience, we move the greener path. They're saying life is a matter of mastering basics and mastering patience More time I get tired of waiting Maybe it's fake procrastinating The times are bad short It really had me sprung Like she got me doing things that I never do huh. You thought that we connected When in fact it was trauma bonding Just leave it up to me to break the rules Never corresponding My childhood filled with fence climbs And knee scrapes and bikes And kicking it by the street signs The older I get I'm trying to lessen any screen time The bounce back heavy I rock steady on climb This world's a fucking loop The news will pick and choose Whatever truth they want to give to you I cannot storm a kit so I Poop. Oops, when life turns sweeter, the lemon mouths get louder. But I'm amplified with ghosts from God, like that boy Fowler. Working like I got that point to prove. But truth be told, the proof is right in the pudding, no point to lose. Uh. 60 for the crepes, yeah, I did that just because. She expected more, girl, you know I'm saving up. Left me on red, well, it was what it was. Never stress over them joints or in downs when times get rough, so I ghost. Long are the days when we was close, now when I see you, it's like two completely different type of ghosts. I approach the weekly fire dropping, which I'm feeding. Still, I don't expect to be the one your boy having but still the songs get spun like Beyblades and teacups My fun fair to those that ever really know me from junk So what's up, huh? I've been the one they all depended on like TJ Now they're dead wilder than a fury knockout punch Leaving them straight stunned, it's hella fun, uh. everybody inside you already know the vibes it's g you know the ties as well first and foremost before we even get started guys please 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 make sure you do smash that like button for me smash the like button for the panel as well we've got a couple debutants in the damn building obviously because there's a few of you in there we'll go around to everybody see how everybody's doing this evening and of course thank you for all joining me for today's Team of the season, player of the season, and young player of the season. Savage, my boy. How are What's you going on? Man? today, man? Good man. Good man. Tired still. I don't know where it's come from, but it's all good, man. You know like that. Are you working today? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. All over the place, bro. Yeah, all I over the you. place. It's all good, though. I feel you, man. Love for jumping in this evening, Quasi. How we doing, man? How we doing? Uh, doing good, man. Thank you so much for having me. Big up to the man that on the channel. No, no, no. Come on, man. Come on, man. And debutant number one, 16-year-old. He's been through the youth academy. He's been scoring a few goals. You know, the scouts, they've been speaking about him quite a lot. They said, you know what? He's ready for first-team football. He said, you know what? Why not? Why not? We're, we're in dire need at this current moment in time. So I said, you know what? Bunny, we've lost our last five games anyway. So let's do it. Flawless in the damn building, bro. How are you, man? Yeah, man. Big up for having me, man. Much appreciated. This is my debut on your channel. This is the first oh, this time is I've the, been over here. Oh, this is the first time. This is what I'm saying. That's this crazy. Is bro. This is That's crazy. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's crazy, man. That's terrible that we didn't, me and that you didn't pattern that. But yeah, man. Big up for having me on. Much appreciated. Shout out to the whole panel as well. Yeah, big up, man. Big up, man. Debutant number two. Also 18 years of age. Plays in the central midfield. Said he's been boxing up a couple men in the middle of the park. We said we needed that grit. We needed that determination in there. Like I said, we've lost our last five games. So thought, you know what? Let's put him into the first team. Let's see how he does. Sink or swim. Sink or swim. Steve-O, talk to the people, man. How are you? How are you, man? Doing all right. Just watching a few games of footy, really, around Europe. That's about it. So I'm just chilling. Typical Friday. Nice weekend. 
So yeah, I'm chilling. But yeah. All right. Thanks for having me on and good to good to see y'all for sure. No, 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 man. Much love, much love. K Mac, you're back again. How we doing, my brother, man? How you doing this evening? And how you been today as well? Yeah, I'm good. I'm good. Um at my at my work, it's um quarter end, so it's been quite mm-hmm. heavy. Um my wife's just made some fajitas. Um I'm just chilling. Good. Oh. Now you got me kind of hungry for some fajitas. And last but not least, Mr. International himself, flying around all the world, signing all those deals. Michael talks. Chat to the people, man. How are you doing this evening, bro? Yeah, just give me a second, G. I'm eating, but big up to everybody in the chat. <laughs> I'm sorry that my stream is obviously interrupting you know, your dinner time. I do apologize. Man, man, bro, I just came outside. And you know what it is, G? It's fucking snowing here. It's, it's snowing. Yeah, you see. It just yeah, look, man. I, I'm in I'm in the deep mud here in Finland, but I'm here on I'll soon be on camera. Give me a second, all right? No, 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 man. It's all love. It's all love. Guys, you can obviously see the caption. You already know what we're here to talk about. Listen, I was, like, it's funny, uh, Savage sent me a message earlier on about obviously asking what we're talking about today. And I was like, you know what? I'm actually tired this week. I am generally tired. Ultimately, we've all of our teams have been knocked out of Europe. So let's just talk about something else that doesn't require us talking about our teams in Europe and focus solely on the Premier League. Flawless, don't laugh because your team got knocked out of Europe a very yeah, long time ago. In that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't worry. You understood. That. Okay. Listen, yeah, man, I understand the MO, man. We went out of the Champions League, you went out of Europa League, we're out of Europe all together, man. It's okay. I, I get it, man. One of us got a semi-final, the others haven't, but yeah, I get your point. Right. <laughs> I get it, man. It's okay. <laughs> All right. Big up, big up, big up. But yeah, nah, man. I said, you know what, man? I wanted to get you guys on, especially, you know, what I mean, just to chop it up, talk football, man. Talk the Premier League. There's been so many good performances this season from certain players. There's been a lot of, you know, teams, especially where I've looked at and I thought, right, you know what? This team's either surprised me or this team's obviously underperformed and et cetera, et cetera. I said, let's just talk football. Let's just talk football where the, we can leave the bias at the door and we can just talk football. So let's get into it straight away. Let's get into it. Guys, like I said, make sure you're smashing that like button. I will, of course, be putting everybody's um, YouTube channel uh, handle into the chat. But if you go to my featured playlist, featured channel list, whatever the hell it's called, scroll to the bottom. Everyone on the panel will be on there anyway. So if you can't find it here, you'll see them on there regardless. So obviously we'll start off. I think we'll start off with, we'll leave the team of the season until last. I think that will be an interesting one. We'll go with the player of the season. Now, obviously, the Premier League, I, I'm, I think that they're doing theirs sometime this month, I believe so, from what I saw anyway. They're doing it sometime this month. I can't remember the exact date. So I don't have, like, nominees or anything like that, but I think there's enough of us on here to potentially do that ourselves. I'll just go around, and then we'll obviously we'll do open floor afterwards. I'll start with Savage. If you had to think of a player of the season, who would it be and why? <laughs> I can't. Well, it's, it's actually harder than you think, yeah, just because of I feel like there's, play, there's players that are uh, the players that are fresh in people's mind of what they've been doing lately, and but mm-hmm. see, it's a long season, bro. Um, and there's a few people that in the last couple of months have shown up, but towards at the beginning of the season, they weren't really about like that, so. I guess you go with consistency. Uh, Carol Buki, yeah. bro, Sorry. that made me laugh. That comment. Sorry. <laughs> I don't know. You know, you might have to come back to me still because I'm thinking like it's, it's very easy to go for the top three teams mm-hmm. and pick somebody out of there. And I think I could find somebody in every team. But then, it ain't really about that because everyone's got different objectives for the season. No, and some people have formed in, in lesser teams. I think, no, a lot of the attack, I, think, I think a lot of the attackers in other teams have stood up as well. Mm. I, I don't know. I don't know. What about Ali Watkins? Well, that, that was my problem. Oh, because, because, if, because, because he's been consistent, but so is Solanke and so is... And they've all got... You know what I mean? I'm not expecting Bournemouth to do what Villa was, Villa's been doing and I'm not expecting Villa to do what Arsenal and Man City and Liverpool's been doing. So... Um, <laughs> If I'm, you know, I'm going to go for who I think has been most consistent from the start of the season. I'm going to go Rodri. You're going to go Rodri? Yeah. He just, he just... By the way, you see when you... 
I don't know how the, the records work, but you see when you lose on penalties, does that count towards your record if we say he's been undefeated, basically? Yeah, it counts. First. Yeah, it counts. Yeah, 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 it counts. I get, I, get what, I get what you mean. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, because yeah, I thought maybe penalties is like, that's separate, so we keep... Nah, you know they count that as a win, so yeah, that's a loss for them, look. Yeah, 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 yeah that's a L. Yeah, without doubt. I feel, I feel like the, the, the couple of ones that I had have been, con they've been consistent all season as well, but... Mm. Throw them in, man. If there's any names, you go in there. Throw them in, man. Well, well, from from the top three it was it was Virgil, um, Gabriel, and mm. um, Pingy and Rodri from the top three, and then obviously Ollie Watkins from Villa. And it's kind of hard because there's been dips. But obviously, I remember that there was the period where when Man City flipped up a little bit, they, mm. he just wasn't playing. He was injured, and when he came back yeah. in, he carried on doing what he was doing. Virgil's actually yeah. been solid most of the season. If you have it fresh in your mind from the last couple of Liverpool games, it makes it seem like he hasn't, but he's, he, it's, until the last like two or three games, he's been yeah. fine and before that just Arsenal game. Um, and then I think Gabriel's been cold. And to be fair to Arsenal, their, their defensive yeah. record since the turn of the year has been pretty pretty good. So that's what I agree. Really loads of no, shots. No, no, no. I, I fully agree with that in terms of like looking at the... Especially mm. when you said Gabriel, because <clears throat> we already know everybody will immediately point to Saliba, not in terms yeah. of, not even in terms of the player of the season, but immediately their mind just thinks of Saliba because they're sitting there thinking, well, he's the quote unquote better defender. Mm -hmm. But the reality is, really, this season, I can't agree with you. If I had to pick between the two, I'm definitely picking Gabriel yeah. um, over, over you can Saliba. Trick, you can trick yourself to periods of the season sitting here thinking exactly. now, back. I, re I remember, like, right now, nobody put Saka in there, innit? But when the season yeah. started, Saka was cooking, bro, when Foden yeah. wasn't. Yeah, and it's like a you know what I mean, but obviously it's fresh in everyone's mind. See if people say it's shit, but well, I mean, he went cooking the whole season, he weren't even playing all of the season, yeah. So yeah. it's like fresh in everyone's mind, he's been cooking, and then obviously the other two, you know, the light skin union, Solanke and, and Watkins, <laughs> the light skin community. <laughs> uh, can, I, can I be biased? But please go ahead, man. Um, your, your choice, not man, but you, you do. I, I honestly, I honestly feel like Alexis McAllister should be in the conversation. Yeah. Um, okay. Comes from a new club, played in a position that is not is not suited to. Mm -hmm. We've been absolutely okay. sensational with him. He's got four goals and five assists, mm -hmm. and you know we're we're only out of the, the quad towards the last like six six games, seven games of the yeah, season right. really, and he's been absolutely sensational. Like, but another player as well, and you know. I don't like saying it because he's a Chelsea player, but Cole Palmer, twenty goals, ten assists. That was going to be my pick. They'd be re they'd be relegated without him. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. And I'm not joking. Like they have been absolutely stinky, but no, he has right. managed to keep keep them somehow. I only didn't pick going. him because of his age, man. Because 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 he said he was going to be the player of the season. Uh, no, he's twenty one. Twenty two, isn't he? Twenty two. Twenty one. Twenty one. Twenty two. Twenty one. Which, yeah, I'm sure he had a qualified for young player. But it's yeah, also exactly. it, it's it's also the case of like people could say he's a Premier League player, but he's not really. He had a handful of games for Man City last yeah. season, mm. and this is his first breakout season. And Jesus Christ, if that's your breakout season in a crap in a crap team, yeah. Yeah. you're all over the place with a 40 year old centre back. Like, like my God, like he is. <laughs> He's got to be up there. No, no, no. Listen, man. I, I, the picks that um, Savage had obviously mentioned there, I think I heard someone mention um, Ollie Watkins as well. Like, yeah. here, you're like, all of these guys would deserve it. Yeah. Of course, you can only really and truly pick one. Quasi, if I go to yeah. you next, who would, your, who would be like your player of the season? By the way, that, that interesting one was um, McAllister that you just mentioned there, but I'm going to talk on that in a minute still. But go on, sorry. But... Yeah, I mean... Um... I think we are just being a look. You're making it too easy when you always add the big, the big four, the big six in there. To me, I would say, I would say Virgil. But let's be honest, man. There's been some serious ballers mm -hmm. who have consistently been playing for their club that we are not looking at. Bruno has been doing very well for Newcastle. Mm -hmm. um, Paqueta, I, I would say, has done very well. Reason why City wants to get him. Mm -hmm. um, of course, the honourable mention, the Watkins and the Solan case. Mm -hmm. um, That's some good I'm, look, 
Yeah, I'm looking at Wolves and what's his name? Al Nurui. Nurui. He's been balling out where now the big clubs are looking at him for the left back. Mm -hmm. Fulham, uh, Robinson has been balling out. So the idea is what will be the criteria to pick? I mean, to be fair, the players you just said, they're all been balling, but the consistency, bro, like I can, there's everyone you just mentioned, I can pick a period where they've, they've dropped off a bit. Mm. And that's what I mean. The, uh, that I mean, I think he has been injured half the season yeah, he has, as well. Yeah, he has. But that period yeah. when, I know it's not Newcastle's fault, they had like 14 injuries, bro, yeah. but there's that period where they they slumped and West Ham was slumped. I think Pequeta, well, he weren't playing though. Mm. But that right. period when, you know, when Arsenal played Newcastle, bro, that terrible yeah. game, bro. There's that period <laughs> where they couldn't pick up a victory. But uh, you are right, though, earlier in the season, remember Newcastle were cooking in the Champions League earlier in the season. <laughs> yeah, it's a long it. season, bro. It feels like it was last season on it, but Yeah, true. it does. It does. Mm. Yeah, and this this is this is what I'm saying. But yeah, sorry, go on, go on. Yeah, so I mean, with me, of course, I'll be biased. I think Virgil has been the most consistent at all the names that I've mentioned. They've been called. Um, we can't forget Foden has done it in the league and Europe too. You know, look what he did at Bernabeu last week. So, I guess the thing is, is always going to end up being the top between the Liverpool, City, and Arsenal, whoever wins the league will have the player of the year coming from their camp. Mm. But I, I I was just saying that maybe we should forget about the top four, the top six for a little bit and kind of look at some I of I guess these. it's the thing, you know, isn't it? You're all right, mm -hmm. and we don't know who's going to win the league. So if, if for example, Man City win the league, then it shouldn't even matter who's from Liverpool or Arsenal because yeah. Villa's not that far right. off anyway. But the one thing I was going to ask, though, G, with the with the young player, what's the age limit? Because uh, yeah, that's so actually I why I didn't say Palmer or thingy because I know Foden's twenty three, but Palmer's twenty one. Yeah, Foden, so Foden Foden wouldn't be eligible for young player this season. Okay, I'll be honest, the yeah. list was tiny when I saw like in terms of players you'd even think of. So I'm sure I saw Cole Palmer, Harvey Elliott. I mean, you could throw Connor Bradley, the Quanzas, and people of that kind of ilk, but they've yeah, changed the age. Yeah, yeah. It was like you had to be 21 at the beginning of July of last yeah. year. So, yeah. and Saka, and I think Saka would not be eligible. I think I need to double check. He might have just scraped it, but I just need to double check. Okay. I know you're not going to like it as well, but I think Garnaccio is definitely in with a shout. Like, as, as much as we all hate Skele as much as we all hate Skeletor, he's been some player for them this year. <laughs> well, only 19. Well, what? Nah, I don't know. I mean, if you're going to say young, I mean, uh, remember that. I, mean, young if you have, I wouldn't have a play of the season. How, how many games have you had now? Mano's had about 23 games, though, isn't it? Yeah, I think on yeah, the young side. Been yeah, on the young side, Mano's some been, been better than Ganacho. I'll say that. I don't know if Mano's been better than Ganacho. I don't, I don't know if he's saying enough games. I remember people doing that about Caicedo. Ganacho's got you. Ganacho's got your nine goals and four assists. Like he's producing. Like he's still a kid. Like he's nineteen goals, but it's more than goals in the system. Like that's just oh. you can't just look at the got, GNA I, and I say he's that got about it's, five goals that were ruled off for offside as well. Yeah, it was, it's really one of five margins, but his performances have been awful. Yeah, that's the problem. We can imagine. He's hot and cold. Have been, if he's, no, he's not hot and cold. He's he's cold and slightly less cold. Like what are we doing? <laughs> you know what I'm it's, it's not hot and cold, cold, man. What are we doing? Like let's <laughs> let's stop this. Like he's not been good this season. And I'm someone who believes he's. Don't get mistaken. I believe some of the criticism of him is over the top. But he's been bang average this season at his very best. Has he had good moments? Yes. But our attack sucks. We scored less goals than Luton Town. We talking about and we want to give one of our attackers play young player of the season. We have you about scored less goals than Luton Town? We scored less goals. See, people are on the facts. We scored less you goals. Bottom, you have a bottom five attack. We, yeah. yeah, we are. We've. I think it's only like four or five teams who we've scored more goals than, and two of them yeah, are at the bottom. I got you, Flawless. Two seconds. Yeah, I bet you have Steve. You prick. Yeah, yeah, you yeah. Have <laughs> you know, this fucking guy. I got you. Yeah, I got you. Does anyone? I'm trying to give. I'm just trying to give some flowers there. Like he's your second top goal scorer. I wouldn't put Declan Rice. Don't give him no flowers. He don't deserve. He don't deserve no flowers. None of our team deserve flowers. Don't give none of them no flowers. Not one of them. There are flowers. They're wilted and dead. Nobody. Don't even give him dead flowers. Don't give him nothing. Speak of explorers, man. Who would your player of the season even be? Oh, what for? Like in overall. Yeah, let me ask for overall player. Overall, yeah, Cole Palmer. 
without doubt yeah. for me, Cole Palmer's yeah. been the player. Like Savage mentioned it in regards to consistency and players mm. turning hot and cold. He's mm. been at, on point yeah, yeah. for the entire season. And not yeah. only has he been on point and played well, oh, he's not only got goals and assists, but his performances have also matched it. So even when yeah. he don't score or he don't get an assist, he's still one of Chelsea's best players. And he is in one of the worst possible predicaments in regards to the players around him. None of us here will say any of their players. Who else in their team has played well this season? Nico Jackson, a little bit. You see? A little bit. You know what I'm saying? That's what I'm saying. A little bit. The entire season, no one. Yeah, yeah, like nobody. And then you talk about the manager, we'd all say, how's he still got a job? These men have been mid-table for... for, They're still mid-table now because they're ninth. And yet Cole Palmer's still performed to a very, very good level. Like I said, not only goals and assists, but also performance-wise, because you have to mix the two. So I would say to me, I think Cole Palmer has been the player of the season. Nah, I feel you, man. Steve, man. Talk to the people, bro. Who's been your kind of player of the season? Mm. You, get most co- you know what? Most consistent, Guglielmo Vicario first. You think he's he's been the most consistent? Fred, go on, speaking of him, go on. I mean, he's making a wonder save every game, just like he was at Empoli. He single-handedly keeps Spurs in a lot of games because they, right, they have the attack and thunder under post to glue, but they, how many ga- How many points has he won? How many points has he won for Spurs with all the saves he makes every single game? So, I think, and, and for me, it the only time that I ever remember hearing slander about Vicario was when they played Everton away on that Saturday, when yeah, he yeah, did yeah, yeah. corner, yeah, yeah. and then there was a game after. Other than that, nobody has a bad word to say. Even like Arsenal fans, if they want to like just like look at things objectively, they're like, he's been a very, very good goalkeeper. So I'd, I'd probably go Vicario. He's made world, I mean, he has made a lot of world class saves this season, but you cross the ball in on that keeper, bro. He crumbles, boy. Yeah, he's done. <laughs> <laughs> he's done. Crumbles. You know how crazy he's like, that is, He's like David James for us back in the old days. <laughs> no, nah, I wouldn't even say he's that bad. David James, <laughs> Calamity James for a reason. Like, they, they, they had him yeah, like, that. Like, they called him James. that for, bro. Like, and, and I don't look at Vicario and think to myself, yeah, this guy's been a bit of a calamity kind of thing. But it'll be interesting when we do get to, like, the team. I, think, the the, I think, overall, I think the, the outstanding contributions... Of him and then the minors, right? Like that is that is a fault of his game. That and that was the same thing at Empoli. He wasn't like the strongest. He wasn't the the best at. But like, how many times has he been like exposed? Exposed. It's not like every single game. Hmm. For every mistake he makes, he probably makes ten extremely good saves or very good saves or get you know saves in crucial points of uh, of the game for Spurs. I'd probably say Vicario. Hey, listen, like I said, it's your pick. You I'll decide. Cole Palmer on too. Cole Palmer too. But I'll I'll go with Vicario. I'll stick with it. I'll stick with it. I feel you. I feel you. I feel you. K Mac, did you mention? I think you said who your player this season was. Mac McAllister. McAllister for me. McAllister for you. Oh, I thought you were going to go back to McAllister and G. McAllister was an interesting one still because I know G yeah. said the, his opinion. You was, you had an honest opinion of him all throughout the season. And I remember yeah. there was a turning point where he got better for you, but but even though he got asked to play out of a out of his out, regular position, out of his position, but he, yeah. but he wasn't. If he got asked to play out of his position, but then he was outstanding in the six, and then he's had the rest of the season. He's had then I'd put him in there, but he wasn't yeah. outstanding when he played out of his position. He was just decent. Yeah. And then when and, I remember as soon as Wataru went in after he got injured, but it was like yeah, Wataru just play him because he was really good then. And and that's that we was never lost. Team. It, we I, never this lost. Is where we're looking, this is where we're looking at like semantic because I could sit here and say, well, technically we never lost with I don't know. Gapo I mean, to be fair, G, we don't we don't lose that many games anyway. It, and, and this is it. Oh. So when when we say these kind of metrics, I'm like, forget the metrics, forget the statistic. When we watched him, I'm pretty sure most of us, not everyone, not, because I know it wasn't everyone, because some people did actually give him a bit of a blight. I was not trying to give him a blight because yeah, I was give him no blight, zero. Yeah, blight. no, no. I, 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 <laughs> yeah, I, I just, I just <laughs> thought he was yeah. decent. I think some people went to extreme, but then sometimes he was just off, bro. Like I remember that I remember that Brighton game when they were trying to blame Virgil and that, bro. I was just like, nah, bro. I saw what I saw, man. This man's making. Bro, I saw what I saw, bro. I saw what I saw in that game, and I think even like Savage just said it there. 
when Endo came into the team, now obviously Endo is a natural number six, so I get yeah. it, fully, fully get it. But when Endo came into the team, straight away, you don't even put McAllister anywhere near that. Yeah, like yeah, it yeah. was like instantaneous upgrade kind of thing. As soon as Endo had obviously you know got up to speed and everything yeah. like that, as soon as we saw that, I was like, yeah, no, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. Now I, I but, feel like I was right in in why but, I was being so harsh. But gee, but gee, you're basically big enough. McAllister even more now because that's the reason why Endo looks so good is because McAllister got the ball more in his natural position. Which exactly. Is, which is why, no, no, but, he, why he deserves it even more. No, no, but that's, as a number eight, <laughs> but as a number six when he was in that position. No, but that's I remember, what I was trying to say. That's what I was saying. I remember red face McAllister beginning the season. <laughs> red face yeah. 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 Listen, if I go online right now and try and, find, and try to find a thing, I guarantee I can find a picture. After every single game, and obviously Bro. it's the beginning of the season, red face McAllister, he looked like, yo, I need to get on. No, it's because he, he just got there on the club. He weren't used to all that running. You know what I'm saying? What no, no, no. You on the club okay. is okay. run. Okay. Fair enough. So we'll use that. We'll use that as context. Yeah, all right, fair enough. Yeah, yeah. You just got there under clock. There was that one game when he got I know taken what you're off going to say, bro. got took off at half time. Oh, which game is this score go? What was the game? Against, Did you say that again? Against Wolves, he got taken yeah, off yeah, half time. Taken when off I saw that looked... performance, I said, I don't want to see you ever again <laughs> in that number six <laughs> position. Because you are stinking up the place like there's no tomorrow and he was drowning like he was fully drowned and i was like we're playing wolves and you're you know drowning that, bro? Oh, trying to make quasi. It it, cause he fingered his like he, he played he was at he was in what, um what score was, was that game it was argentina versus was bolivia game? like two days before and no, it was, i think it was two yeah. zero right he played Wait, at half, like, down. and then they no, we won the game we won the game we won the game but were you one nil down though yeah we won nil down we were playing one nil down that was the game when Fingy and that was Cunha was playing shit where we kept missing open goals, bro. That's why we that's why we should have yeah. ended the game yeah. for us right there. Because yeah. Neto yeah. destroyed us, bro. <laughs> bro. Defense, bro. He was getting ran down by the oh, I can't remember the wall central midfielder because that was the first oh, black guy, the short black guy. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ron Gomes and Mario Lamina, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ran down by a man, I was like, damn. Because he, just looked, he just got flustered on the bench. And mum was like, oh, yeah, he played at high altitude for Argentina on the weekend. <laughs> high altitude? <laughs> like, get out yeah, of here. You remember, remember, remember the photo he had with the inhaler? He had the inhaler as well in Bolivia. Yeah, <laughs> <you> know, <laughs> like, like, it, it was getting right silly. Like, like we, was, we were just making... It ended up being a point here where we just started making so many excuses as to why he just wasn't performing as well as he... As I've seen him, even in that DM position, by the way, I've seen him for Brighton in that position. That's what was bugging me because I was like, I get it. Klopp's tactics, Brighton's it's tactics, they are a bit different. So you're doing a lot more you running what, here. Man, I, 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 was, I was picking up for him because yeah, I thought it was being too extreme. But after, I don't want to want to talk about him. After yesterday's game, I remember why I don't want him in the six blitz because are oh, you kissing me off? Savage, thank you. This is what I'm saying. I'm, I'm not even passing the ball to no one and that brother. Nah, nah, nah. Hey, what can we put some buzzer in there for the first five games? No. Team of the year. No? Like I said, it's your team. It's, it's your it's your player of the year. When we get to team of the season, that's where I'm going to be interested to see you lot's picks. Okay, Michael, we'll okay, go to I'm you. I'm saying Cole Palmer. I'm saying Cole Palmer. No, no, that's cool. <laughs> Came back changed so quick. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Look, you yeah, shouldn't yeah, have yeah. mentioned the Liverpool no, but, player. Geez. Again, no, no, you take... No, no. No, 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 no. I, I didn't Cole mind Palmer. when you said Virgil. When you, I can't remember the other player, but I when it came to McAllister, I was like, I'm not doing half seasons. I'm, I'm, I can't do half. So seasons. we don't want. So no one wants to put Palmer in the young player. We just want to put him in the regular one. Uh, but totally you, but to technically, you, you can. Technically, you can win both. You can do both. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, you can. Because that's oh, what I'm saying. Didn't Harlan win both last season? Yeah, so. you can win. Yeah, you're capable of winning both. Like that's. Didn't win Rooney and Ronaldo do it? Yeah, because to me, he is the winner. He is the winner with both. But Ollie Watkins oh, for the older player, 19 goals, 10 assists. Like, he's been yeah, yeah, Watkins. That's he what I, that's yeah, that's name I said. Watkins. Watkins. If I had to pick an outfielder, I'd go Watkins, but yeah, I'm a stick with Mario. Okay, cool. Michael, chat to the people, bro. He's created nine, he's created nine big chances as well. Ollie Watkins. No, 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 he's done I, would, I would go for Alexander Isak. Okay, to be honest. Uh, I, really, uh, season, I, think he's, I think he's been. No, nah, he's played 24 he's games, I think. Lot. And he, he's got 24 games and he scored 17 goals. I think that's a pretty good contribution <laughs> compared, right. compared to what Newcastle, and Newcastle <laughs> have been injury raveled all season. I think he's been quality, honestly. Without him, I don't know where Newcastle would be. Probably like 10th, 11th, 12th, somewhere many, around there. 
How many games has he played? God, Ray Issa. I think the he's only 24. issue is the injury. He's, he's played 24. 24. And he scored 17 goals. Yeah, yeah. don't get mistaken. I think his quality is his just the injuries. Goals. That's the no, only the injuries, thing I look the, at. The injuries, yeah, I think he's been dealing with a groin injury all season. I think that's been yeah. the issue for Alexander Isak. But anytime he's played, I mean, I think he's been the best that's player it, on the field. 17 and 24. That's crazy. Yeah, you want to know how many shots he's, he's had on target with 17 God. goals? God. 30, 33 shots. Yeah. Jesus Christ. Oh, I it, thought I would wish he could do that. Jeez. Newcastle need finger back, man. They need Joel Linton back, bro. Yeah, yeah. 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 that's why. Yes. That's why I kind of want to give it to Isla because I think I with think the team so. that's been raveled by so many injuries, he's actually really stepped up. You know, we can talk about Rice, you can talk about Rodri, you can talk about McAllister and all these guys. I think Alexander Isak, and when his team needed him, I think he scored against Liverpool, Man City, Chelsea. And I think a couple other big teams. Like he shows up against the big teams, you know. So I do like I do I like I that, and that's that's kind of what Flawless said as well about Palmer. Though, like he's playing in the. I know they've got all the money in that, but the shit, bro. Like Chelsea's. Isak has also scored in yeah. six straight uh, games for Newcastle at home. Six straight. Past yeah, six he's quality. Yeah, like I said, he's he's quality. The only I don't think there's the I only... don't think there's a standout player. I think everybody's gonna have a different answer for player of the season, which is kind of weird. Whereas you look at past seasons in the Premier League, there's definitely a standout guy. This season, I mean, have your have your pick, bro. Have your pick. You to know, be honest, though, Michael, the same thing happened last season because it was yeah. a two horse title race. Was it, it was though? Like... I mean, everybody was... picked Holland. Yeah, because normally what we expect yeah. is one of the top teams. They'll yeah. have a player who has an yeah. absolutely yeah. exceptional season. So we'll look at him individually and go, he's quality. And then we'll look at his yeah. team success. But when you look at City, you go, yeah, they've been good, but, they, but they've been very good, but they haven't been City yeah. of old. You look at Liverpool, yeah. obviously the majority of you lot are here and there's no one you're like, Salah would normally jump, normally be Salah. Salah would normally be in yeah. contention, but Salah's not been at it. Same with Arsenal, you mentioned Saliba, you mentioned yeah. Gabriel, but none of their attacking players. Have been at it or midfield True. players you go with. by the way Saka can, is eligible for the young player this season he just turned yeah. 22 at the beginning of the year so okay. he's just about eligible. Yeah, man, he can limp up, he can limp up and get his award in it you know what i'm saying <laughs> <laughs> yeah, actually michael you know what it's like... <laughs> <laughs> oh, it seems sorry. <laughs> nah, Michael, I actually because I actually get that he Gordon's our player of the season because he has played some more games and he's consistently he performing for me. So, but Isak, you're right. Like 17 and 24, it's actually That's more impressive that he's played less games. So, I mean, I'll take I'll take how, ta how many games did he miss last season, Steve? He missed I think more last season, didn't he? Yeah. I think he had a big injury last year. I think he had like an ankle points. injury. Crazy. He played, he yeah, played like 22 20 20 or 23 or something. I didn't know that. I think I he's going to get to like 23 goals at this rate if he just stays healthy for the next couple of games. So you imagine he would have played – Imagine the goal rate he'd be at if he if he was stayed fit for five six more games. Yeah. Let's say he played and also, thirty games and flawless. If, if Newcastle were fit as well, if Tonali, you know, yeah, didn't yeah, do his yeah, Michael, yeah, Michael Jordan and started gambling on everything. <laughs> I mean, see, this is like a lot of these players. <laughs> oh. hey, imagine, man, imagine, hey, the, yeah, imagine, the goal. Imagine the goal rate Isaac could have if he was playing for us. Shit. Well, instead, right. of Nunes. City. instead of Nunes. Instead of Nunes. Listen, imagine, Nunes, imagine I'm, not, I'm not here. I'm not here to get onto Nunes. Like, I'm. He's not in any conversation that I think we're gonna have today. Anyway. G, G, how, how many goals go. do you think Alexander Isak like, would, would get if he's at Arsenal this season? Uh, Arsenal. Yeah. For example, because they are gonna create more chances than Newcastle. No, okay. He, how he many have you got now? How many have you got right now? Seventeen and twenty-four. It wouldn't be much. It wouldn't be that. Actually, much. Mike, I don't Mike, think it'll be that much more. Though, there was a guy. period where they weren't creating chances, and that's what the Arsenal were screwing about around Christmas. If we so, want to do these, sub if we want to do the subjective stats, big chances. Newcastle are second in the league with one hundred and seven. Arsenal at ninety three. Jesus Christ! But I think I think well, he's well, he's with that. Big chances this season. Yeah, we, yeah, we, we well, our attack is actually. I have never and flawless can back me up on this. Michael can back me up on this. Whenever I'm complaining about Newcastle, I. Hardly ever complain about mm -hmm. the attack. Hardly because I, I think he helps the over Arsenal attackers in regards to rather than them just creating for him, yeah. he, he's also and you'll know this, Steve, because you'd be watching Newcastle from when I watch Isa. He also helps create for others. He's not a striker who just scores goals, like his link play, his ability to run him behind. Martinelli, would, the channels, Martinelli would eat with him, yeah. Like he would definitely mm -hmm. help to me, Saka. And like, put it this way, he's miles better than Kai Havertz. So oh, he doesn't. He is. doesn't even provide any assists, though. Yeah, Isaac doesn't, like doesn't provide any assists. I think he. I yeah. think Isaac would be insane for us because he gets a lot of one-on-ones. Yes, which and he's very the only place that Isaac wouldn't be insane at is Man United. 
hey, hey, hey. This yeah, ain't United. Well. Hey, hey, we don't need yeah. to talk about us. All right. no, 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 allow it. We don't need to talk about us. This guy. Uh, it's unnecessary. Uh, it's so unnecessary. Uh, <laughs> the only man United fan is going to come. Yeah, well, oh, this is it. This is I'm it. saying. Like, yo, right, I don't know any more than Man United. Yeah, it's outrageous. So, yeah, okay, if you guys have to pick here, if you if you all have to pick, and I'm not asking for your own team. I'm just saying if you was to pick a team and you only had a choice of Isak, and Ollie Watkins, both fit and available. So let's take away all that rubbish. Who would you go for? Only one slot. Who would you go for? Forget he's anybody like else. He's like all day. Oh, he's yeah. Like, yeah, yeah, same. He's like, I just for, think he's better for, overall. For my team. For my team. If you have to pick a team tomorrow, we're, play, we're, play, we're facing off against the, the Space Jam monsters. We need one of those two <laughs> to be able to, to get out Ollie Watkins. <laughs> Ollie Watkins, he can do more. Oh, this stream is great. No, 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 I hear it. He's been good this season, so I can't even knock yeah, him. He has been. And his record, good. His, his, his record in previous seasons is very good as well. I looked at it and I was like, damn, like, you've been scoring goals. He was for Brentford, he was banging bad goals. Yeah, yeah. Um, for a minute. And it's like, he kind of just crept under the radar. I was like, I'm going to lie, but Tony came from the lower leagues. Yeah. I'd probably pick Watkins, you know. I wouldn't, if you asked me this two, three seasons ago, I wouldn't have because he used to run like a fat girl on it. And I didn't like it. Bro. <laughs> I, you need to explain. I don't understand this fat girl yeah, running. What like. does that mean? He runs like a fat girl. Bro, just, just wait. Just when you see a boss or a train, just watch a fat girl run. Bro. That's what he used to run like. Like he shot himself. And yes. like, since <laughs> uh, since he had his little pro direct advert and got lean and that blood, he's been balling still. I respect it. Yeah, you know what I mean? Man. Discipline and that. <laughs> he's got a good variety that, of goals as well. Bro. Like a fat girl, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I like his variety. He easily just said, "Looks like someone running for a boss or a train." But hey, he's <laughs> yeah, so he added in the fat girl part. Yeah, yeah. Fat girls have a and swagger when they run for shit, bro. They look off <laughs> equal, you know, equilibrium happen. That's what I'm saying, bro. <laughs> to be fair, this is his best season. Um, it's, sorry, this is his joint best season yeah. in football. Um, the only other time he got, um, he's got 26 goals in all competitions at the moment. Yeah. The only time he did that was when he did that for Brentford, Brentford in yeah. 1920 yeah. season. Yeah. Um, was that in championship? Yeah. Championship. In the championship, yeah, that was in the championship. Yeah. That was in the championship. 46 games, though. To you say. know. You know what I will say though, and it, it you know, someone's gonna say it, and it might as well be me and be controversial. No, no. Salah's only played 26 games, you know, and he scored 17 goals and nine assists. But would he you say he's in the conversation? This season, Salah doesn't matter, it's what he's no, done. Of course, it does. For the team. Are we talking about goals and assists or are we talking about performance? Yeah. It should be both. Uh, it should be both. Exactly. It should Salah's had some incredible both. games, he's had some he incredible has. games, maybe one. Nah, 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 bro. Use that. How many goals do you man say he scored? 17? Oh, which one? 17, 20, 20, 26. I, I respect the contributions from Salah, but I dare you, man, to tell me one great game he's had this season. Yeah. Go on. Go ahead. I'm hey, run, hey run, it, run him our way, man. My, my front... My, uh, yeah, yeah, give me, give, me, give, me, give me Rasmus and you take Salah, bro. Yeah, my first front three combined. They got 17. Saying, if, you look at, if you look at our three combined, whoever played the most, they probably don't have 17 goals, but we move. It's usually talking about four, you know? I have no I mean, idea. Salah would Sal Sal probably yeah, be on the list if Nunez missing sitters. Like, seriously. But you, you, you see, you see, this is what this is why I always get baffled with these kind of, and this is why it's good that we're having this conversation because I even think when people pick the player of the year, like last season, it's not only the fact that Haaland scored an outrageous amount of goals in the entire season; it's the sheer fact that his performances helped Manchester City to one win the Premier League, the FA Cup. Um, and the Champions League, but forget the Champions League, the Premier League and the FA Cup. So you're looking at that and you're not just saying, yeah, well, because he only scored goals. Bro, we was watching some crazy hat-trick against United, hat-trick against this team, goal, goal on, uh, debut goal. Like, the guy was doing madnesses, like, for fun, scoring the most dumbest goals you've ever seen, like, in football in a general sense. His overall play was actually good. This season, obviously, you can't, maybe you wouldn't really say that. That's why with Salah, and he's my guy, I would love to put him in this conversation. He doesn't even get a sniff. Player would you say Salah's like Harlan G in, in, in regards to he's like that? Like, in he's regards like to it, but holes, no, without but the, the performances clinical. haven't matched. Yeah, but I'm yeah. not talking about goals overall because Harlan, I bet if we check his record, is actually decent in terms of goals. To oh, yeah. It's like Salah's, oh, but yeah, the yeah, 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 performances yeah. haven't matched. How many goals? Eight Highland top goal scorer at the, at the league. Yeah, he's got twenty. He's top he's yeah, he's 20. tied. So he's, he's twenty, and we're here talking about yeah, your performances have been there, and it goes to show like yeah, goals and assists is all well and good, but course, yeah. the performances have to match. Yeah, they have to. Palmer yeah. scored nine penalties as well, isn't it? So not that. 
Because you gotta think. You gotta. Okay, you gotta think. How many goals do you think Harlan has scored this season? Just if you had to say off the top of your head, like roughly how many goals? In all competitions or four. in all competitions? How many? Thirty-four. Thirty-four. Yeah. But thirty-three. I won't say He's that. Thirty-one. He's got thirty-one goals in thirty-nine games, and this. And we're not even sitting here saying, Jesus. yeah, he's been the outright best striker because his performance, as Flawless said, his performance ain't matching that. So You know what? You, you know, know why that that's happening, though? Why everyone's noticing it is because Man City's performances against the bigger teams, they ain't winning yeah. them. So if they, yeah. if he had scored against Chelsea, I think they've drawn against Chelsea twice, on it? Yeah. They've drawn against Liverpool They've only been Man United. That's it. Yeah, yeah. And they've but, lost to Arsenal. Reggie, Reggie. Yeah, we, Reggie, you well, said last year. Well, it's facts. Right? Right? It's facts. Yeah, right? <laughs> no, you're right. No, I'm saying when people say, oh, you scored against big teams, it's like, yeah, we don't count. We, 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 we Everyone <laughs> scores against, you know what I'm saying? Like, that's oh, no yeah. feat. You know what I'm saying? We terrible. We don't count. Yeah, but G, on, last year. Did that say Drogba was an elite or elite goal scorer? What was he said he wasn't an elite. He said he wasn't. Yeah, he was. I don't. I don't think he was an elite goal scorer. He wasn't. He, wasn't. Scorer, no. he, wasn't. he, 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 he had one elite good player, season. Man. I think it was 2010. He's an elite player. 2010, he went what, crazy. Well, he's what we're talking about in regards to performance. Drugs, performance. drugs performance. performances yeah. was cold. Yeah. That's why yeah. you forgave oh. him not getting goals and assists because he could right. get mad at the match and have no goals and assists. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. One of the players we're talking about doing that. Salah or a Haaland are not doing that. I've never seen them get have a game where they get no GNA and they get mad at the match outright. Yeah, Drogba's a complete attacker. Dr Drogba's record for Chelsea, I'll read out that in all competitions, yeah, from the first season he joined, 16, 16, 33, 15, 14, 37, 13, 13. I promise you this guy was not an elite goal scorer. Like. He, no, he wasn't but, an elite no, goal scorer. G, was the big season 2009-10, right? The big season was... Yes, yes, 2009-10. Yeah. yeah, I remember he was... Crazy but but look at that, look at that. Look how Michael just plucked that year because he remembered the performances of Drogba alongside goals. you know yeah. the goals yeah, yeah, yeah. obviously scored. So that's why I think God, man. listen, by the way, I, if I could throw Salah in, I'd be throwing him in all the time. I'd be like, Yeah, but put Salah. I can't put him in this season because I'm like, you have not performed well this season, but you have got your GNA, which is why. You're here. You're Do you know what's that, you know what's actually crazy, G? That they've already uh voted the player of the season, they already had to put their votes in. And that's foolish with with six, seven, eight, nine, ten go. No, they do it like around yeah. January or something like that. No, they no, do. No, they do in April. April. That's why I was trying to. But first, I thought they. First, okay, they it's the first week of April. That's the due date. First week so, of April. And we don't even know. And by that time, who was top of the league? Liverpool yeah. Arsenal. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, like, they might already. Yeah. It was really Liverpool weird. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look at look so at the FA chat. The FA try to rig it because they know Arsenal are terrible in, in April. So they try to get Arsenal players in it. That's what it sounds like. Because they always fall oh, yeah, off in that moment. Thingy, it? The FA Cup yeah. sponsored by Emirates, bro. Yeah, man, 100%. I, I see the game. The FA Cup sponsored by Emirates. These lot can't even get by a win. Yeah, they need their face plastered so, around everywhere, right? <laughs> so we're definitely are we definitely going for an attacker as the player of the season? No, 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 no. I'm going what to what say is, though, even though even though I said young player of the season is Palmer, and I would yeah. stay, I think he's young player yeah. of the season, player of the season. Young player of the season, I'd also add in, definitely give him an honourable mention, a doggy. I think he's been very, very oh, good for Spurs. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Now is he 19? First yeah. season in the Premier League. Yeah. And he's performed exceptionally well. You could argue he's been the best left back in the league. And that's, and that's testament. 21, yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's like, testament to him. His form that's, of late has been a bit sketchy. Testament to him. Like, yeah, also, only, it's fell off a little bit. Yeah, 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 but yeah, that's yeah. only as of like late. The Newcastle match game, week. he was poor. He was yeah, poor. yeah, as they all were. But that's match week. What were we in match week day one day two? We're talking two? about him now. Yeah, Kyrie, if, man. Claudio Ranieri's Kyrie. Very good. If if I'm honest, I I I, I think Van der Ven's been 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 probably better than that's him. The second best because that's a new yeah. league as well, and he's Van been thrown ben into a back well. a back and two. Yeah, but again, Van der Ven had that injury. Was out for a minute. Yeah, if he didn't, if he'd have not had that injury. He'd be in the conversation. Didn't they, they all get injured? Yeah. Didn't they all get injured in what one game? Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. They all got yeah. yeah. And they all got suspended at the same time like, as well. Been, they all got injured at the same time. <laughs> Where is Ben to cure back? Does anyone yeah, yeah, he's back? Yeah, yeah he's yeah, back. Yeah, yeah. But, yeah, exactly, exactly. Yeah, yeah the fact that you asked him tells you about his performance. No, because he was like, I was like, yo, no, Ben to cure is all right. Like, I would love to have someone like that. The ginger you does not like a footballer, Kulovesky. Is he, is he back? Oh, him, yeah, shit, shit, Kulovetsky as well. He, nah, he's been. He's I mediocre, like, he's bro. He's he's this strange game. Game, bro. He is not a right winger. Like a footballer, bro. On no galaxy in this world is he a right winger. No chance, Kulovetsky. So we're not. So we're not. We ain't confirmed on who's the player of the season, then. 
I was thinking you know about <laughs> <laughs> You might go around the panel and just ask one name. Did, yeah, did yeah, everybody yeah, yeah, give yeah, a different I, answer? It depends on how many. Like, I'm gonna if there's a tie, I would be a, a decider to that. To pick I'm up. saying, I'm saying it's Virgil. You, there's Virgil has been the most consistent through day one to now. You could say maybe two or three, two or three of uh, Crystal Crystal Palace. He didn't play bad. The whole team played bad. I hear it. Savage. Yeah, I'm going Virgil. Flawless. Yeah, Palmer. Steve. Vicario. Okay, man. Watkins. Mike. Isaac. I'm going Virgil then. <laughs> to be fair, my pick was Virgil. It was Virgil. Just in terms of consistency throughout the entirety of the season, it was everyone else that we all named. I was like, I feel like they've all had like these weird dips where you're like, eh, yeah, for like four or five games, I barely even noticed that he was here or whatever. But for the rest of the season, they've all been good. And I feel like we everyone made a good case for all of these other kind of players. If we maybe, as Quasi said, if I said you can't pick the top four teams and you went for maybe the rest, mm. yeah, that would have been a tougher conversation because then you're like, Isaac, yeah. Watkin, Paul Palmer, whoever, Vicario, Van Der Schoen, whoever you want to put him. But I just think Virgil, for me, this season, I just feel like he's just performed the best the, for the longest. Let's put you down. Yeah, because I was trying to, because I was being harsh at the beginning because, like, oh, there's games when only lately when Liverpool's not got the result, but even in them games, man, I'm like, that's not Virgil, but like, yeah, yeah, games. yeah. So, I don't know. Shout out to Bing as well, man. Douglas Luiz, I think he's been cold this season. Forgot oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You're yeah, not saying yeah. there's so many honorable, oh, and oh. I think this season might not be, it shouldn't be. As black and white, obviously, I'm saying Virgil because I just think it's Virgil. But yeah. all the names that you lot just said, I can also see if they won it, I wouldn't be like, How did he win it? Like, I definitely wouldn't be mad if Watkins won it, I wouldn't be mad if Isak won it. If Palmer oh, was to for them, I definitely wouldn't be mad at that because I think he's been cold this season. So, yeah. you know, they're, 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 interesting they're, they're, to see that there's no, um, apart from when I mentioned Gabriel, there's no Arsenal players we mentioned. Well, I did. Nah. I was, was going to ask about Saliba. I was going to ask yeah. about so Saliba. It's yeah. those two, and that's it. Is Saliba? Or, like, I don't think you've asked Arsenal fans. I don't know about is now. He, they is, he in, and Rice, is he in contention? Is he in contention? Twenty-one. Is he in contention? This is I needed to I needed him to fight his case. Oh yeah, Saliba. I think I don't know if he's in contention. Young player. Is he twenty-two now? Twenty-one. He's twenty-three. Twenty-three. But he did have his brethren masturbating behind him, so we can't pick him. Yo, right? Yo. Hey, none of that. We don't. None of that. Lava, All right. So, it? moving on to the young player of the season. <laughs> on that note, um, <laughs> <laughs> chat to me, people. Chat to me. Yeah, we'll, we'll just do open floor manager. Just and then, we'll, and then I'll go around eventually to go one by one. Who you guys? Obviously, I, mean, I know. Is there really Palmer any people. argument to this? No, nah, Palmer. Palmer. You think it's just unanimous? Paul Palmer. Palmer. Yeah. Okay, so let's do this. Let's do this. If it wasn't <laughs> Paul Palmer, who would it be? Yeah, I was just about to say. If you, if there was another name, who would it be? I already said the doggy. That would be my pick. I already doggy. said that. Yeah, I think he's been top quality. He had uh, occasional game where he's been bad, but like that's it. Like, yeah. Steve, I like some of our young still, but they've, they've actually it's kind of been up and down for both of them. Like, actually, not up and down. They've only been a couple of games, but they both haven't had. Quantum and Bradley they had that many games as compared to the rest of them. So, mm. yeah, yeah, Mike, yeah, yeah. Mike, did you ask me how, how old uh, AG Gordon is? Gordon, yeah. he's twenty three. Yeah, he's ah. twenty three. Yeah, I just see it now. He's I would have said him. Yeah. Cool. Say no more. We'll move on, man. Let's do the team of the season anyway. Like I said, I don't want to keep everybody here for too long, regardless. By the way, people, make sure you're smashing the like, sharing, and subscribing at eleven o'clock. I will be over on Sarcasm City. TV, we'll be talking what, about what, what video are you doing, flawless. Say that again. What video are you doing? Oh, yeah, I do. But mainly, you I thought, oh, yeah, yeah, a big off of you, finger video still. Watched you, um, that's what I was watching last night, bro. Uh, was it Savage and Sarcasm? Oh, oh yeah, the Sarcastic and Savage show, yeah, appreciate yeah, man, that's it. Cold still. I like that, let's appreciate it. Yeah. You know, not everyday football, and that. Well, gee, what are yeah, you smiling for, bro? I'm definitely smiling because nah, I just you, why, why you got big grin on your face, bro? Just relax. Because I feel something pop up on my screen. I was like, I was trying to share the screen, and I was like, I hope I don't share that screen. But I was gonna ask I was... and I was like, shit, don't share that screen, boy, because these are gonna start asking stupid questions. I was gonna um, ask before we go to team of the season, what should we add this category of who's the flop of the season when it comes to transfers? <laughs> James Madison. <laughs> You know what? Let's do it. 
Let's do it. Who would be the flop? Because that's a season? really interesting, interesting debate of who is actually like the flop transfer of the season. Oh, transfer. You, you, you said flop. Yeah, yeah or, 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 or flop of the season, whichever one, whichever one. That's easy. I think, I think, I think we Phillips. just do just yeah, just 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 flops overall, not just necessarily flop. transfers. Okay. Yeah. yeah, that's Phillips, right? Oh. Uh, no, and it, it was not that. I don't do that on my computer. Thank you very much. Um, Yo, Quasi, don't you think Phillips have been through enough, bro? We don't need bullying. Bro, Just relax. bro yeah. <laughs> I, feel like, I feel like it's now actually turning into bullying when it comes to Phillips. I've never seen anything like that, bro. All the talk about him. He gets to West Ham. Yeah, his manager you know, calling him fat. Man scored a <laughs> own goal and got sent off. Then all this, bro. Yeah, he's, yeah, he's been bad. He's been bad. He's he has been bad. Been. If I had Just to pick on this season, though, because the because obviously some of the players I'm thinking of, I reckon they will get better. But off that price, though, Caicedo, bro. Oh, Caicedo, it's got to oh. be. Sorry, it's got to be Caicedo. Sorry. I, I don't <laughs> even I don't have, a, I don't I have him as a flop this season. I can't. Yeah, I don't like. think he's, he's been he's that bad. Not, but again, yeah. he, what man just said, he's yeah, been I worth agree. 116 million. Yeah, that's it. He's not yeah, been that bad. His fault. <laughs> but we, I, if we expect more from him in terms of performance. That's I'll be honest, I'm sure I don't watch every okay, Chelsea yeah, game, yeah, but every yeah. Chelsea game I do watch his shit. I've watched, I've watched it, like, I've watched a lot of Chelsea, like, he hasn't been bad overall, but he's been underwhelming, you expect more when he goes okay, there. Okay, yeah. How are you, okay, but, like, yeah. we can't we can't hit him with the, oh, look at the team when you perform better yeah, in the worst yeah. Brighton team. Sebastian, what, what, what did you last season? What did you was last season, I mean, it wasn't this season. Yeah, right? but we can still throw him where you can, because we said just flops in general. Oh, yeah, transfer. Yeah, yeah. I watched Chelsea fans boo the manager when they took Mudrick off. I mean, they took the... The top one you got and left Sterling on. That's... Yeah, it's because Sterling had that mare. It's because right. Sterling had that mare, didn't he, when he took, yeah. he took the free kick off Palmer and... It's... Yeah, yeah, Susan is a problem. problem with step peace takers and not listening to authority, don't they? Like, if it's not free kicks, it's penalties. They need to sort out um, sort yeah. that out, man. That supply to you. I knew going to mention some other line, bro. I knew, I knew somebody's going to mention him, bro. <laughs> <laughs> you, you, do you agree with that, though, Savage? Oi, bro. I plead the fifth, man. Allow me. Are we playing? Nah, nah, nah. You, that ain't you. You ain't played in the fifth, man. You don't do them things. Now, you know what it is, bro? I'll tell you Go the on. truth here. Go because on, I've been you. mentioning his performances the most. Everyone's yeah. just sending for me to all day. And people keep messaging me about leaving him alone. Listen, bro. I, I made a statement earlier on it. I said, this season, man, has been Lucas Lever with 99 shot power, bro. So, Shout out Lucas Lever. Wait, wait. This is the most lines of flop. Stand, stand on it. It's only I based mean, on the season, bro. We can't it's only based on the season. If we, based, if on we come from... based on Hungarian Steven Gerrard. Come on, man. You don't go from yeah. Gerrard to like... He, he tried to give Atalanta a through ball again yesterday. It's like oh, a game yeah. I'm not so bad that yesterday. Oh, yeah. Oh. Oh, you what? Yeah, oh, Hendo, no, Hendo, I mean, Hendo. I mean if, I'm, if I'm going for Liverpool, then it's got to be Graven Birch. Absolute waste. I knew it came back. Came back. Like, it's Graven Birch. You in this 34 beef million. Beef, really 34 million. I mean, he's going to get loaned out to Turkey. By the looks of it, wow! So it's going to be Oxley Chamberlain. Yeah, that's what's going to happen. It's going to go to the Shikhtas and travel. No, but I think it's more talent than an Oxley Chamberlain, though. Like, do you get what I'm saying? Like, I hey like man, Ox was cold before that yeah, injury. Respect Ox, but what are you doing, man? No, 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 no. Cold. Okay, can we? Okay, okay. Guys, 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 guys. Mike, 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 Mike. Can we stop? Can we stop this narrative that this guy was cold? Before he got injured, he was not cold. Before he got, he was okay. Before he got injured, yeah. But I gave him cold. extra ratings because he's got the you know the little mixture on that Perry and that. Little, you know what I mean? A little stripe for Bro. that one. Come yeah, on, yeah. okay. Yeah, that, I'll, that give goal, him, I'll give that him a plus for that. I give him a plus for that. But I don't think he was cold. Like I looked at him and I was like, "Yeah, you're okay." Like, like you, you've got that in in your locker. That one or two goals that no, you. I, 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 I understand you. You're right. It's that one it's because that season in particular, when he got injured, he was good that season, and it, that's it. Yes, he was good that yeah, season, yeah, yeah, yeah. and he's cooking in the Champions yeah, League, and that it was over. But then, but we made out like this guy was like the second coming of Gerald. I was like, brother, like he wasn't that good. Like he was okay. Like let's put it this way: the way that we talk about Thiago, and we're like. If we, oh, we wish he would stay fit, and man, I would love to see him. Like, if he was fit, I definitely wasn't saying that about Oxley Chamber. I was like, bro, you can leave. Like, I don't want you here anyway. Like, he wasn't that great hey. for me. Oh yeah. Hey, G, G, Stefano makes a good point. What about Money Mace? Oh my God. Lola's totally forgot about, about your guy. I've honestly oh, totally oh, forgot oh, about oh, him. I'm, I can't even. Is he? I can't say he's a flop because this is what I expected from him. Because we should have never signed him in the first place. You know what? Well, I will back flawless here because at the beginning of the season, I was watching streams. Flawless spoke many times on many streams about uh, Mason Mount, and he kept asking everybody, "What does he do well?" I can never forget you asking that. <laughs> Coming which channel it was? 
but no one had an answer. No one like, got what an answer. Did he actually do well because he does he's nothing well. Injured. He's, he's been, been he's played, he's been injured, but he's played enough to the point where he made no impact because yeah, the time before he got injured, didn't he have that was, weird start when he had done nothing? Yeah, because he's, he's done nothing. Like, you know he had only played a few games. Maino had played a few games, but Maino makes an impact and you don't. We should have never yeah. signed him in the first place. He's a man of many, he's a man of many trades and a master of nothing. He does nothing. We all, well. we all know man. Wait, he costs 60 best, million. Yeah, yeah. Manu's yeah. best, yeah. Man yeah. best money mace is at Getafe blood. We know that. It's yeah, it's facts. It's ridiculous. I say, though, listen, that. I say I listen, I'm a Liverpool fan. I hate United, but I think you should go full scumbag and put him back in the squad. Bro. Nah, I ain't saying all that, bro. but like, yeah, Two we should have never. Hey, hey, hey. Two hat tricks like and man will forget about the elbow to a jaw store. You know what I mean? Let's go, man. Like that, that, that money, that money, that money you paid for Mount basically stopped Chelsea from getting. Yeah, because we just chance. foolish. Like I, I still can't believe that people got behind it and backed it. Like and I was like, there's still Bro, clips of me out there now, and people, people backed it. it. I was like, and first and secondly, by the way, just 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 quickly. Yeah, Savage, what about Amrabat? Do you take this comment off the screen and move on? <laughs> <laughs> Take it off the screen and move on, bro. God, about by the way, I said Mason Mount. I said, by the way, I said at the start of the season, Mason Mount would not score more than two goals in all competitions. He's at one. That's not that a was surprise. The Brentford game, right? This is this is this is, this is a man yeah. with eight open to play assists in his entire career. He don't. No, no, I said, well, I said under him. two goals. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm Jesus. saying that's my point. Is he doesn't do anything. He has eight open play assists. Yeah. No, but people are looking at me <laughs> funny when I said that, and I was yeah, because like, people no. are foolish, Steve. You know this. You know what I'm saying? We know what people are. Funny, funny. I'm tell you what. United got some. I'll tell you what. Though flawless, there was a lot of Liverpool fans that wanted him. Yeah, because he fits what Klopp's trying to do. I see because he runs a lot. That's yeah, he's like, he's like Gallagher, in it? Yeah, he's right. Gallagher, right. Henderson, yeah. same thing. Well, he, 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 he would have had a better season than Sabolso, wouldn't he, Savage, for us? <laughs> Elliot's had a better season than Sabolso. <laughs> That's not... Lie, I think Steve, Steve said no Liverpool fan who thinks Sabolso has been better than Elliot this season. There's no way. No, no, no. no. <laughs> not over no, course of the season. My flop is James Madison. That's mine. No, that's a bit harsh. No, 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 no. He played well at the start. He played well at the start. I, he exactly. Off he played well. Nah, at the start. I agree. I agree. What? Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I agree. I agree. Madison played no, great. He got injured. He was out for ages, bro. When he got when he got injured, he was he was top assister in the league. If he had just been able to carry on, I reckon he would have had like a calm season. What do appearances? Four goals, seven assists. How many has he got? That's Say that again. What's the numbers? Say the numbers on, again, man. Not, let, Let's be honest, man. We, 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 we haven't sat here and watched that game. Newcastle was the worst game. The numbers, the numbers go on, go on. 22 go goals. Yeah. Or sorry, 22, no, 22 goals. 22 games played, yeah. four goals, seven assists in the prime. I think that's so not, 11, that's so not that's 11 goals and assists in 22 games. That's, that's every not bad. Every game, every game, he's every not every game he's getting a goal or assist. He is not going to hit 10 and 10. He's not going to hit 10 and 10. I'll say I'll say this Spurs are only anywhere near top form be, top four because of yeah. him. Because exactly. yep. their attack is shocking. Take yep. Son out and take him out. Their attack is a business. Which, which flawless Bro, is he's what, dealing with Timo Werner and Brennan injured? Johnson. Uh, oh, yes. I know, I know. <laughs> Timo Jerba and Brennan Johnson. He has now and Richarlison. And Richarlison. Oh, he must be thinking, well, that's a fine, heavy. If you, all right, fine, fine. Whatever. Maybe I'm too harsh on Madison. Tonali, then. That's the no, we were told nah. Madison was the best number 10 it's in the Tonali. That's a good one. No, I was, was going to say, was gonna say Tonali. No, no, no. We got a, are you man being serious, bro? He literally was said. cold until he got injured, got back, and he made an impact straight away. He he him no, no, no. Like His worst know. game was against Newcastle, and he was still making chances. I thought you meant what? Tonali. <laughs> no, nah, no, nah, Tonali's in the game. Tonali's in the game. Tonali's in the game. Tonali's in the game. You can't be betting on games, bro. I'm sorry. You can't. He's fought for the season for me. You know what my favorite bet was from Ivan Tony? Man used to bet on Brentford to lose when he weren't playing. <laughs> That's nuts. <laughs> <laughs> nah, bro. Tony said, wild, you man are nothing without me, bro. <laughs> Lost. <laughs> Listen, oh, I, 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 like, All I'm, right, I'm, I'm really All right, fine. Fine, Havertz is my flop. I'm standing on it. I don't give. I, Havertz. Nah, I get, I get, I get you went from Madison. Steve, you going all over the place. What, 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 uh, why, why? Why? wouldn't go Havertz? Is good. I didn't expect anything from him. Did you expect anything on Miss Mount? Ain't Havertz done no, better than everyone expected? That's why I wouldn't put Mount as a yeah, flop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
I didn't have yeah. mountains of my flop of the season either. Like, how can I say you're a flop when I expect? Okay, but then, but then from when you. I said Madison, because I expected ten and ten by now, and then but that's below. Like, but he's, he's not been injured though. though. Like, like, he's been injured. Been he injured. would have if he had I'm played more. He would have more. He would have that ten and ten. If he, he had would played have two games, though. he probably have that ten and ten and close. If he's seven and four. Yeah. Also, if Jonathan wasn't up front. Uh, yeah, like we no, have no, to no, he's 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 That's right. He's, 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 he's got four and seven. Yeah, so he's three away in the. I'm assuming the seven is for assists. Three away in assists, and he's six away in the goals. That's nine right there. I'm feeling like he would have got nine in the, the whole time that he was injured. Like in that, if he just played the at way least. he started the season anyway, bro. Him and exactly. yeah, yeah, yeah. Really, 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 really good based on how he started. Yeah, Steve, Steve, if um if your manager hadn't got Timo Werner, he probably would have. <laughs> no, it's me, the Newcastle fan. Yeah, I'm Newcastle. I, I'm oh, okay, Newcastle. Newcastle. Yeah. I'm not good at picking flops, then. I don't know because every one of them is like, I didn't ah. say you're not good at picking flops, Steve. I'm just saying, Madison. Who did yeah. anyone? I just, who, who, I just who, think who, he's been underwhelming. Yeah, but there's a difference between underwhelming and flop. Yeah, that's, that's what I'm the saying. Thing. That's a I, I agree with you. I'm a big Madison fan. So if someone said, I'm disappointed. That, but yeah, but there's a big, there's a huge difference between said, underwhelming and flop. Lab Bro, I haven't even seen that in the season. Lab 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 has been injured the whole I time. thought he's a hologram. It's 30 yeah. minutes. Yeah. Again, to Sebastian, that's me. I can't call players a flop when I expect next to nothing from you. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. If I, I say like you're rubbish and you was like, it's like Mount. I can't call you a flop. This is what I expected. Was he got one goal? Zero got expectations and signing this. Okay, season. then yeah. by that by that metric, then uh, flawless. Yeah. Do we say Onana is a flop? Yeah, you could say Onana is a flop. Mm -hmm. I expected more. Yeah, because he, he, he when he when he entered Man United, yeah. he he was a top five goalkeeper in the world. Now, yeah, I mean, I don't know what. Now he might not be top fifteen in, in the league, but Jeez. yeah, hey, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Bro, I the league has a losing start in it. You know, I crazy. You got a point. Nicolas Zaniolo. Nicolas Zaniolo. Yeah, it's only Olo. Yeah. I mean, but Steve, we saw him make up last night. That guy, that guy's betting as well, so it doesn't really count. He's a talentless ball. <laughs> People thought they was getting something out of him. Hell no. But, 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 Steve, they didn't, but Steve, they didn't watch him at Galatasaray. They knew that guy was just betting on games, and he didn't care about football. So I, I expected nothing else from Zaniolo. Uh, all right, well... The, all right, let me, look, let me look down the list again. Jesus. Oh, <laughs> Stevens is going to pick somebody random next. <laughs> if I'm going off expectation, I'm going Kaiseido or Sabaz Alive Breath. Can't even lie, Breath. I'm just happened? picking one. If it's one overall. Just me, off expectation yeah, probably, alone. Yeah, it would be. If it's, you're going one overall, it, for me, it'd probably be Kaiseido. I expected so much more. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I think yeah, I'm going to yeah. go with yeah. How does Sabaz Alive is a flop, but Madison is not? They both started out very high. They both started out. One was injured for time. The other one wasn't so, Just listen to how Liverpool fans are talking about the so Buzz Lightyear. was injured for quite a lot, for some time, too. Twice. He came in, played half a game, and then he had to go out for weeks. Let's see how long these injuries for. I mean, Dom, if, if, if you're right, then fair Dom's, enough. I'm, I won't even say I'll Dom, say cool. Bro. Dom's got a number of factors, really. He's new to the league. He's playing in a position where he's not played before. Like, Kai Sado's literally gone into a team to basically do what he did at Brighton. But then, are we not giving the Chelsea shit. factor? Like, like, is that not being yeah, exactly the shit. chaos of Chelsea? Look at Obama. Yeah, yeah like, Enzo Fernandez look at next Obama. to him. Yeah, yeah Obama. Obama. But, look at, right there. but look at Chelsea, though. Like, we're, yeah, we they can't have to get it. Like, I think it's been decent. Right now. I get, I get what you say. Nah, Gallagher's in midfield. He's been he's, good. Yeah, nah, he's Gallagher's been good. Gallagher's rubbish. Yeah, like he, he's not. I said he's been dog shit. But you don't regret it. Like Gallagher's not. Who rates him? However, with your boss, like there was hype surrounded him. Let's not do that. Just because he's yeah, better than the world. Yeah, around yeah. Like, mm -hmm. hype around the buzzer It was hype yeah, yeah, around him. Exactly. Because I've been going emotionally. Right, because I'm sure the buzzer is going to get better. But I, yeah, hate to do it. All right, fine. I hate to do it to a fellow Hungarian, but yeah, I'll, I'll put, I'll put Zobba's lie on that one. Dom's got seven goals and four assists. Like, he's not. Like, he's probably scored more goals than any other man. But that's the same as Madison. That's what I'm saying. Like, I was just about to say that. That's what I'm saying. Surely nobody thinks about has been better than Madison, but just on performance. Because we're talking performance, no, that's where been. the performance yeah, 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 And has he played he more hasn't. matches as well? How many games has he played, Shabazz Lai? He would have. Played. Played. He's, played. He's, played. He's, played. He's played more. Probably like 26, 25, somewhere around there. Shout out Hungry, man. Shout out Hungry. Let me check right now. Right, right, Buzzlai, it's all right, bro. It's just... No, it's a Buzzlai has played 39 games. You've seen him for Hungry. That guy. Wait, how many games he played in the league? How many in the league is it? Oh, nah, look, nah, it's definitely Sabozalai. I've just seen how many games Madison's played this season. Um, Madison's played 22, played, right? Uh, Madison has played 22. In the league, 
in the yeah, in the, the league, league um the Bozilla has played 30 27 30? 27 okay, and Madison's so. played 22 so he's played five more matches okay, yeah so. So yeah, this is yeah, it's not a conversation then. Yeah, Five no. games. It's okay. more. Obviously, so obviously no, 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 we know that he's not rubbish on that, bro. But you know, no, 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 one's saying that these guys are even rubbish. Yeah, it's like, once, once, no. once, okay. once Clap leaves, he'll be cooking some craziness. <laughs> okay, so so far we've got we've got the best player is Virgil and the worst <laughs> signings. <laughs> <It's like, laughs> okay. Yeah. Then expect a bit more. <laughs> No, nah, listen, man. If you guys, if you if you guys are saying him, then listen. I'm not. I'm gonna. I'm not gonna disagree because I would definitely put him in there. In terms I think of the Caicedo, front. but but I think. It but yeah, no. And Caicedo again. I, I have to admit, from if we're talking about forget the price, I don't even care about the million, price, man. expectation. No, no. But to me, it's nothing to do with the price. As in, the price doesn't even factor at all. Like I don't think about the price when I think of him. I just think, what did I expect of just you? As a player, you're not you don't determine the price, but you determine what you yeah, do on the pitch. How you it depend, the, yeah, the price was also based on how good they said he was gonna no, be. No, no, yeah, uh, but we also know Chelsea. We know what Chelsea are about. Yeah. We know Chelsea. that these men, bro, they just bought Lavia and the guy's been injured all like these guys are throwing money away like it's going out. You know what it is, G football's changing, man. People are buying players very quick now. So, like from when one yeah. team gets them, they're buying them a season after. I remember not I'm not saying I was against Liverpool getting them, of course not. But I remember I kept making this point before we were linked to him and his link. I was like, is it, are we sure though? Because the season before he had 10 games and then the season started, I remember he played a really good game against Man U then everyone started talking about him. But that's just like being a, not saying he is, but that's like, you can have one season wonders who just turn up for one season, bro. And then, go, and then they go away. So it's a lot of money to pay for someone who's been good for one one season. before. He cost, what did it cost, Brighton? Three million? It's a big jump. So, yeah, literally. Yeah, yeah it's three million. Million. Jump, So... Yeah, the thing about it though is like you when we when we seen Chelsea buying all those players, yeah, we must have been sat there going, bloody hell, these are gonna cook this season with all of these. <laughs> I said seven for them. Like, I, 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 I expected them to be better. I expected them to be thinking, better than what it was. Seven. Man, I, can't, still, I can't lie. I thought uh, I thought Onana was going to be amazing for United. We still have to talk about. Ethan, Amorabad, I really though. thought Onana yeah, was going to be. That's what like everybody a, told yeah, me. Yeah, I, I, everyone I everyone told me Onana is this and that. I was like, all right, we actually getting a goalkeeper. Let's go. And then yeah, he's been better. Yeah, he's been better in 2024. Yeah, he's been better. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's been better. He still made mistakes, but he's sorry, no one ever managed. He's been no one ever managed. People, people did not watch. People did not watch football. They only watch. Uh, Champions League final and thought that Onana was supposed to be this. Oh, I watched Mitch from Milan. No, no, no. Back, Onana was, Onana Onana was class. No, 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 he was class. Did you watch him at Ajax? Did you watch him at Ajax? Hey, yeah, I watched him at Ajax. Why do you think they kicked right, him out? Of course, they like... You, you, you are no, because he got he had the drug di- drug problem. That's why. Yeah, most yeah. people didn't <laughs> watch it. Well, like, most... said that you have the drug problem. Like, yeah. Yeah. most <laughs> people just watched the Champions League final. They did. Back most I hands. agree with that. Most people were watching him week in yeah, week yeah. out. They never watched week or go all his mistakes. Go to his compilations and go to his mistakes from Ajax, and then come back to my new. There were some bad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, he definitely I've had got some bad ones at Ajax. Yeah, I've got to be honest. I'm really impressed with my, Michael's um, knowledge on scandals with footballers. <laughs> oh no! I've been watching. I've been watching Italian football for too long, buddy. That's why gambling and drug problems. Yeah, man. I follow them. Prison FC has gone in many members this season. That's for sure. Prison FC. Listen, prison I'm FC. Oh, what a... in yeah. to prison a... FC right now. Hey, we're right, building let's an academy on. now. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I'm not trying to even get into all of that. All right, let's go to the Premier League team. Of the season, this one I think will be very interesting. I'm going to assume, and this is only an assumption, I'm going to assume we're going to go with a 4 3 3. 4 2 4. What? 4 2 4. This guy. No, no, no. Let me explain. I'm going for no, two. No, don't explain. Just, just no, don't, don't, Steve. <laughs> no, no, don't, Steve. No, no, don't, Steve. No, no, don't, Steve. No, no, no. I love you, no. Steve, but no. No, no. Uh, we love you, Steve. I thought it was no. going to be simple no. where we're all going to just agree on the tactic. Nah, and bro, just... that don't work, bro. No, nah, 4 3 3. 4 3. In my mind, I'm going to stand out. Midfielders are strikers, though. 
yo, we just go home with this. And then if we Three, have to four, change three. it later, no, but that's we will. the thing though. I can't think. Oh, no, you know, actually, you know, I was trying to get Isak. Realistically, it's got to be like it's got to be four three three or four three three one in it. Whatever formations played the most in the prem, and it's them two. Yeah, four. which is one of those, which yeah, is yeah, basically yeah, yeah. variations. Oh, basically of those two anyway. But if you do four two three one, then you can only use one attacker really. Um, that's, the that's three up front, the, yeah. the three up front, they can all be like just forwards. They don't yeah, have to be yeah, like. Yeah, 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 yeah. And that was another thing because I'm not doing this like, well, he can't do this. He got bro. Yeah, it's honesty, man. We need to yeah, do the yeah. four, right. the four, three, three, man. How else are we getting Shabazz Lamb and McAllister in the side? Let's go. <laughs> How are we getting? That's good one for us. Mason Mount is the right wing, center mid, right center mid, CDM. Mason Mount. That was a good one. Got to get him. It's not going to be a Liverpool team, I'm telling you. Goalkeeper. Vicario. Kelleho. Allison. The fact that we Mar- just named three goalkeepers in are flipping up. Martinez. <laughs> this is going to be this is gonna take to... long. Martinez. I'm actually trying to. What goalkeeper? Martinez is, is a shot. I'll go Martinez, actually. I'll go Martinez. Jesus Christ. Man, them. I thought this would be like, yo, yeah, no. Now nah, you I'm just gotta gonna go to go 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 everyone go. individually and vote. It's going to be Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude, the Donny with the nostrils, bro. He's been good, man. Say that again. The Donny with the nostrils at Arsenal. He's been good in goals, though. It's crazy, you know. Oh, rare, 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 rare. He's like, yeah. All right, I'm just gonna work my way from top to bottom. Hey, yo. Okay, man. Yeah. Uh, Kaminsky. You see this? Oh, I'm saying. Kamin- oh, Kamin- Kaminsky right, for Luton is flawless. Kaminsky. Kaminsky for Luton. I go Martinez. Emmy. Quasi. Allison. Mike. Martinez. Jesus Christ. Steve. Vicario. Savage. I beg you pick someone who's already been picked. I said Martinez, but okay, cool. I, Stop I racially know. profiling me, bro. I said what I said. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. I'm not my. He's phenomenal. The thing is, I'm sitting there trying to think. Did I actually? Like, did I say something? Like, what is it? <laughs> I was to him to think that. Like, if I did, I apologize. Like, all right, right back. Ah, we go right to left. You should have scored that. Uh, who's the top of the list? K-Mac. Right back. Yes, sir. Uh, oh, I'm trying to think. Is it Dougie or right back? Left. No, left. Back. left. Uh, yeah. Um, Pedro Poro, Dallo, some names. Ben White. Ben oh, White. Dallo's, Dallo's been really good this season, actually. He's probably been Man United's best player. Who's um, who's been right back for Everton? What? For when you're asking, yeah, that, that tells you that you don't even know. <laughs> 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 uh, that, James Coleman. Probably Ben White. Focus. Ben White. Ben White. Cool. Floors. Yeah. Uh, I was thinking Ben White, but you know what? This is the only time I'm going to get to see United player, so I'm going Delo. I hear it. No, he, he's been good this season, so I wouldn't disagree with that. Mm-hmm. Quasi? Mm, I'm going Bradley. Okay, fair enough. I'm not here to judge your, your choices. Uh, Mike? <laughs> I'm not here to judge your choices. <laughs> That's like an alcoholic thing. I'm going to go buy a drink. And a, a so that means Bradley's <laughs> getting a <laughs> Bradley is, said, I'm going to go chat to that girl, you know, and man's just like, yeah, I'm not going to judge your choices. I'm not going to judge your choices, bro. Like, I'm, here to do that. I'm here to be, you know I'll what I mean? I'll go Ben White. Ben White. I'll go with BW as well, Benny. Savage. Yeah, Benny. Looks like it's Benny. Benny Which would make it two seasons in a row because he was cold last season as well. Yeah, he, he was. was good last season, Trip, to be fair. Not Chip. Was it? Chip here? Chip here? Right. Yeah. Oh, no, no, no. Right. That, that, that Long Island like, tan is working well. What's going on with that skin tone? But um... Yeah, you got to remember, man. <laughs> Trippier Trippi started amazing, then it fell off a cliff. Yeah. With... Oh, he did, yeah. he did, he did, not he did. last season. Not, no, I was talking about last season. Yeah, trip yeah, yeah, but this season it started off good as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then January about, yeah. decided to be a straight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Crazy, man. Crazy time. Yeah. I'll, I'll hey, you Ed, if you weren't way. messing around on holiday, then you would have had your say as to who your thing is. Right now... Say ben White's not been good. Ben White, yeah. Just, Again, just this is the agenda that he's come with. I, I don't know. Sipping on that red stripe on the beach, bro. Just allow him. Peter Collard has got two hits to drum, I think. Just for him, um, he should get it as well. <laughs> <laughs> we'll go straight to, we'll go left back, left back. 
I couldn't even think of that many other than Udogi. Like off the top of the yeah, Udogi's my pick. I already said him young when I mentioned yeah. young player of the season. My I opponent. can't but being I half guess. American, I gotta add an American here. I would say Anthony Robertson. I think he's, he's been, been cold actually. He has I been good. I agree. I agree. I don't know if he gets in. I don't think he gets in team of the season over Dogi, but I got to give a shout out to Anthony. Actually, wait, so, no, nah, shout out my boy Emerson Palmieri at West Ham, you know. Oh. That should be mm. very okay. uh, yeah, they, they I need to stop with the faces because, again, I'm not here to judge your choices. Yeah, yeah I'm not, I was just about to say, Steve, I'm not here to judge your choices. Yeah, it's cool. I'm not here to judge your yeah, choices. You, uh, you so, I don't care. Go with Gomez. Quasi, who'd you go? <laughs> Robertson. Oh, shit. Sure. Yo, what right. about Andy, Andy Robertson? No, no, no. Not enough sample not size, not Steve. Not oh, you're saying Andy Rob Andy, Andy Robertson? No, no, no. no, no Anthony, Anthony, Anthony Robertson. Robertson. Oh, you're saying Rob? Oh, okay, okay, okay. Uh, and then not, who are you going with? Sorry, sorry, uh, sorry. I'm going with the doggy. The doggy, Steve. Hey, Rob. Anthony Robinson. Shut up. Okay, okay. I'm just making sure that we're not saying Robertson. Um, no, 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 Anthony. David. <laughs> Same. Robinson. Who? Right. So I, I didn't think we'd okay. Okay, fair. No, 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 no. I'm surprised by it. I thought people were gonna go in my brain, it was thinking that you're gonna go with um Udogi, but fair enough. Fair, fair, fair. Right. Two center backs. We'll go left side and center back. I feel like this is an easy one, but unless someone has other Virgil. Virgil. Yeah, Virgil. Is it Virgil and Saliba? Sure. I'm is excluding everybody in the conversation. Is, yeah, is it Van Dijk and Saliba? Is, is it also yeah, Saliba? Saliba, Saliba as well? Van de Van for me, but... No, I'm going Gabriel. I'm going Gabriel. If we, well. if we were saying Gabriel was going to be... Uh, the that was my the season, Gabriel. Yeah, so... Uh, go Gabriel, then? Right. I feel like he's been better yeah. performing than Saliba this season. Yeah. First. Does he play on that side? <laughs> I don't know about Saliba, but... Oh, okay. Okay. All right, DM. I feel like this one's a bit of a banker, but again, throw him, in a, throw him in a move on, man. Okay, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh. I heard Wadri three times, and I know there's not that many. <laughs> right. yeah, I've heard JP, but, yeah. No, no, I heard, I heard, but like I said, there's three people, in, there's the three names plus my own. That's four. Left side is sentiment. Copy Mano. I'm joking. <laughs> Your team, bro. I'm not here to judge. To judge you know, I'm just here to listen. Man said, uh, more than the, than the villain that. laugh, you know, bro. I didn't... <laughs> say that, sorry, say that again. I'm here so on vibes, man. Laugh, bro. I'm here on vibes, Savage. I got nothing. You know what I'm saying? I've got nothing. I think, I think he's cold, man. I think it's cold. Yeah, 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 by yeah, the way, just, by the way, I'm not drawn in by the you know his latest stuff and that, bro. I, I, I've been knowing about him, so he's cold, man. Right. K-Mac, sorry. McAllister. Flows. Uh, it's tough. Take I'm not sure. Take your time. No worries. I am going to, man. I'm sorry. Oh, gee, would Douglas, count, would Douglas be as the number six? Who is the central midfielders that have stood out this season? I'm trying to think. No, uh, I'm really. No, I go folding, actually. I think folding. Even though he's had dips, I go folding. Okay. First, first, first. Uh, Mike? No, sorry. Quasi, 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 quasi. Um, who? Mike Allister? Mike? Foden. Well, it's 2-2 two, two right now, but... Steve? Mm. That's a squeeze. Yeah, he's gonna say like that. Well, it's damaged your Canada decider here, like on this one, because it's two two right now. Yeah, with what's it one for? For the McAllister, UJ. Steve, did you say Douglas? No, I said Douglas. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I said as well. But I asked you, I didn't, I didn't hear Jesus answer when I said because he's. What position? But what position? I thought he was more of a six, not an not an eight. If he's not, yeah, a, he's not a six. Mean it because there's one person holding, and then you know what I mean. That's why I was a bit confused. Wasn't he playing more as an eight? Imagine when, uh, it was flat wasn't he more of an eight, eight when Kamada was healthy? Yeah, that, that's what that's why I said it. Yeah. On paper, it looks he's like he's a six, but in the game, yeah, he's playing more of his eight. I'm gonna he go with him. Eight. I'm gonna go with Douglas still. Wow, we have two two. For you know what? You're right. This season he's played 38 <laughs> games in centre midfield, and I think he's been he's been so consistent. Bro. So we needed to, are, we, are we picking those two uh, those two in the midfield slots? Is it Foden and Douglas Luiz? 
Well, this is only for left, centre, mid, and it's 2-2 two, oh, two at the moment. Okay, oh, no, 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 no. It's technically... Because two of you went for McAllister. Two of you went for Foden. Two, two went for Douglas. Two went for Douglas. So I have to pick between Douglas, Foden. Or you could yeah. pick Ross Barkley, but... Yeah. No, no, no. I'll, I'll go with one of the three. I'll go with one of the three. Um, Ross Barkley been sick by... I feel like I have to get him into the team at some point in time, you know. I can't even lie. So I'll probably just go with Foden. First. Yeah. Mm. I was gonna pick him. But we still got right to the midfielder. We yeah. still got right to the midfielder. I think this this would go to Erdegaard, in my opinion. But I would have put Erdegaard left central midfield and then whoever else on the right, but you but know he, when he that play, would go. Yeah, but Erdegaard plays more on the right. I wonder if he put oh yeah, he does, yeah, yeah. Because yeah. yeah, he's yeah. like out of on that right side. What? I thought it was such a narrow man. So we do Foden Cole Palmer in midfield there then? Because nah, I thought Palmer, Palmer, right. Palmer, 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 Yeah, Palmer's right wing. I'm just going to put Palmer yeah, straight yeah. back in then, because he's... What? Technically, no, because it was still a draw between McAllister, Foden, and Douglas Deweese. So you could put... Really, McAllister wasn't a left central oh. midfielder. That's why I was baffled why everyone... Yeah, yeah, like, well, if it's a draw between Douglas Louise, what is it? A tie for RCM for Douglas Louise and McAllister. And McAllister, yeah. I'm going Douglas. All right, Douglas, all right, Douglas Louise. Let's go. Right. Yeah. That was fast. Yeah. Man didn't even give a give McAllister a second foot. <laughs> nah, what about it? Like, I, I listen to you lot like, like, on the stream talk right, about it. I listen so to hard. you lot on the stream talk about McAllister. <laughs> and I've heard you lot, or I've heard you in particular, G, all year long, all season long, talk about McAllister. So he's not getting into the team of the season. I've heard out uh, Liverpool fans. I don't think I'm the best person for you to have stream. It's not just you, though. It's multiple Liverpool fans I've heard <laughs> talk about McAllister all season long. Okay, cool. As long as it's not me. As long as it's not just me. All right, right wing. I'm picking Cole Palmer. I don't know if anyone's got any objections. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Palmer. No, Palmer. Palmer. The left wing, that's he... when I started to scratch my head a bit. Oh, oh, oh this is where I come in. Ooh. Oh, no, actually, no. I've got a name. I've got a name. Oh, Hey yo, course, yeah. yo, hey yo! yo <laughs> this is Easy. a family friendly show, guys. By the way, but yeah, go on. Uh, uh, K Mac, left wing, left wing. Mm -hmm. um, uh, I'll come back to me in a minute. Flaws. I was I was going to put Bowden there. <laughs> I'm trying to think. Like in regards to left wingers, yeah, it, it, this is a, a head scratcher in regards to maybe. Uh, I know he's played central at times, but maybe Son. I know he plays wide left. That's what that's my pick as well, man. Yeah, Son. Okay, two for two for Son, quasi. If the chat knows of any, let us know because I really. He, this is where uh, it starts getting no. yes, with left wingers. I promise you. My pick is Son or not Rashford. Brother, that, that, you, you, you wow, that was so that, unnecessary. That's just so unnecessary, man. What was the unnecessary Sorry. stray? Sorry, man. Let's say Gordon Gordon's a stray. Anthony Gordon. Gordon. Yes. 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 Song, I mean, song is the easiest one, but. Son isn't playing on the left, though, this year. I looked at, I looked into this that's, yesterday, like, that, deep. That's why I said, like, in regards to, even though he's played central more often and at times, I still, he's played it from the left at times, too. Hey, you know. But Werner's been playing left. I thought, yeah, but Werner only got here in January. Yeah, and he was still Great. playing, Son was playing central when they had. Um... Hey, he's fantasy, man. There ain't no, been no better left winger than him. That Kudus. Time. Apple yeah, Kudus, I was thinking, yeah. I was thinking Kudus or, um. Yeah, I was with Neil, yeah. man. If 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 it wasn't for injuries, Neto's that been cooking, bro. Yeah, but them injuries, bro. Like, yeah, them injuries, man. No knee cup. Right. <laughs> Yo. Um. All right, let me start. So I'll start again, just so I know. K Mac, who did you go with? Well, left hand side. Yeah, left hand mm -hmm. side. I mean, Saka's right hand side, isn't he? Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Martin, right 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 yeah. Uh, yeah, kudos. No, no, no worries. Flawless. Yeah, I'll go. What's it? I'll go, son. But I can't think of a man is saying Gordon. Mate, yeah, I'm on, son. Has son, son been playing left hand side? Is he? He's been playing. It's a mix. He's played he's central and he's also played yeah, left hand side. Yeah, Jonathan came back in. 
Yeah, it's, it's a mix. He has played out. He has played wide left. I can't think of no one else. How many games does I, Anthony I pick, Gordon have to I, I, pick, I, I pick Son in front of uh, Kudos if you put him on the left. Mm. Son's been in, insane. 15 goals this Kudos season. Kudos played less, less games on the left as well. And, he, and he's played half, and he played the the, UA, the what the Asian Cup as well. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah, yeah, gone for a month. It's absolutely ridiculous. Well, yeah, Son. Um, if we... Yeah, I think it's between Kudos and... Some depending on if we're gonna allow them to switch because Kudus can play across the front three. Mm. Yeah. Um, yeah. So we need, and it's, so, so is Bowen. I think Bowen has done well this year. Too, Bowen, Bowen has been playing this well. season. Yeah. He does yeah, spend more time yeah. on the right though, but I do. Yeah, I love him when it's cold. I, yeah, I would say Kudus right now. Okay, Mike. Um. This is crazy, yeah, because when I think about the left-wing market in just general, even forget, like, team of the season, I'm always like, yeah, this market is meaty as hell, bro. Well, like, obviously, no, and Mbappe, like... Mbappe and Russia are trash. Well, and, and G, I mean, yeah. there's the guy from Napoli, too. Can't um, forget about sorry. Kiwata. The guy's cold. Other, other, uh, other than the three, like, sorry. Rafa Leal as well. Yeah, yeah Leal, too. Uh, I'll yeah, probably yeah. go with Gordon, actually. I think Gordon's been good this season. He's been... At times, he's been the only one fit for them at, for Newcastle's front line. Everybody else has been injured. Callum Wilson, Alexander Izak. Uh, I mean, Almiron, don't even get me started. Arm. Almiron. I mean, that's not a footballer. I mean, Almiron's not a footballer. I know. He's, yeah. so, Gordon, Gordon going, scored against every Gordon. top team in the league as well, you know. Yeah, only yeah, player true. to do it. Yeah, he insane. scored against Liverpool after Trent's mistake. Yeah, forgot about that. Every top team. Yep, Steve, I know Gordon. your pick is Anthony. Yeah, Gordon. I'm going Anthony Gordon. That's the one I'll die on the hill on. But yeah, yeah, Gordon. No, and no, I don't no, do no. this. I, I am I'm the sorry. least biased person out there, bro. I swear. But I'll die on that Gordon hill for sure. Sev, so, hey, came from our youth team. Yes, it did. Thank you. <laughs> Sev, you're saying Son. So we've got two for Son, two for Gordon, and two for K Mac and Quasi. Jesus Christ, but can't you not just pick the same person? Hey, G, this is Sorry, G, that we're trying to create. Channel. Hey, hey, G, our apologies. We're trying to create conversation, you know. Exactly. <laughs> 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 our apologies. I'm so sorry. I better send so PayPal sorry. at the end of the stream. G, I said so. Okay. Do you want me to make no, 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 well, you know, uh, again, I'm not here to judge. For, yeah, choice. for the man who says oh, he's not judging, it sounds very judgmental, but we move. That's I'm a really good shout, by the way. I'm not judging the truth. I'm ask, I was just hoping Gee. that would come to you. Yo. Gee, that's a really good shout. Someone's just put it in the chat, and I, I think I think that's a better shout. Foden left wing, Rice midfield. Foden's Rice best has to get in that midfield. Rice yeah, has Foden's to get in that midfield. Yeah, I feel like none of Foden's best work has been from the left. Yeah, yeah, like but you just have to get Rice in there you can't not have Rice in that midfield. It's because Rice is fighting yeah. up against Rodri, and that's what I'm saying. Like, I, I wouldn't have Foden Ryan, there. Right, right, like, look, I would. I don't mind moving Foden into left wing. That's cool. And then put Rice but in there. I can't see Rice can't be the eight because he's not an eight and he doesn't I play there. So I, I can't keep that. Nah, Rodri's definitely staying. Keep Rodri up. Put Pascal Grossin and then Pascal Gross as well. Pascal Gross. Pascal Gross is cooking, bro. Bro, has been excellent. Hey, there's cooking and then there's not losing for 60 odd games. I mean, yeah, that's a good point. Yeah, <laughs> there's definitely a difference. <laughs> but then, but he has been cooking. I would definitely not say that he hasn't. Yeah. But I don't mind taking Foden out and moving in position. I think but that makes sense. Foden right, left. Yeah, he's not bro, just Foden is capable Scott, of playing from there. For what spice is Scott Parker and that Rice can stay out of this, bro. No, no, no. I, I just said I'm not putting Rice in central midfield because if we're going to do that, I would have to put McAllister instead. Because McAllister's been better in central midfield than than Declan Rice. I can't put Rice in centre mid. But you guys had Douglas Louise there. That kind of threw me because I I, I hadn't really seen enough to put him in a team of the season. What you got but against Brazilians, man? Low it, man. I like Brazilians. Well, hasn't he got like hasn't he got like nine <laughs> goals from midfield as well? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's got the GNA. Hey, G, you want to finish that sentence, fam? Finish the <laughs> sentence, man. You know what he's thinking. We know exactly what you're saying, man. We know exactly where you was going. I see that. I see what was on the horizon. Yeah, man. Finish the sentence. You know what I'm saying? No, so, like I was saying, guys, if we want to move Foden into a different position, please let me know, and then I can always move him. G is well trained. <laughs> <laughs> we don't uh, judge. We don't judge your choices, man. It's all good, man. Well, it's sounding you very like, judgy like. right now. Well, so like, 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 like
<laughs> if you want to go double pivot, then we can go four yeah, two. Go four t- Listen, if Donny's listen, you, say, you know what? Rodri's you know what? Arsenal have lost. Arsenal have lost. That's, a, this is my thinking though. Why can't yeah, it just be right. Rodri's better than Rice? Yeah, he's just been better. It's not. It's, yeah, you know what I mean? Been, but but everyone Arsenal, else has to deal with that in the team. But Arsenal have lost a lot in the past couple of weeks. So you know, title race, yeah, yeah. Champions League. That so they need to win right. something. We need to pick up their spirits, man. Nah, fuck them. No, I definitely don't want to pick up their spirits. This is going to be You do know we've got two Arsenal players in here already, bro. So it's not like the the they got. Gabriel, I'm Ben White in there. Yeah, man, that's true. Yeah, Arsenal fans, there you go, man. Be happy with Ben White and Gabriel. Yeah, man. Bugger off. Um, so are we moving Foden or are you keeping him there? Uh, keep I'll him keep him there. there. Okay, cool. So left wing, <laughs> we're back to this discussion. Uh, <laughs> no, 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 G, no, G, it's your pick. Okay, yeah, I'll go pick, back. You pick G. I'll go yeah, back. Yeah, that, there you go. Are you sure about that haircut, blood? <laughs> bro, why are you dissing the man's hair, bro? I just need one need reasons not to pick it. I hate him, blood. I hate him. Never mind his like, hair. Never mind his hair. Have you seen some of the clothes he wears? Yeah, man. Yeah, <laughs> like so with this in a man's personality, <laughs> he, style, he, hung out, he hung out with that. That's, that's crazy. That's crazy. Nah, that's right, Michael Story. He hung, he hung around that handbag in it, bro. That's his bridging, bro. Who's the oh uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Young yeah. Dominic, bro. Boyfriend's at Sheffield and that. crazy. Wait, what? Strike. Gordon over Kudos? Oh, 100%. Oh, he's, yeah, 100%. He's Kudus plays central. He can play That's right. That's what I was going to say. Kudus is not speaking about it's, it's David Moyes' freestyleness. You know what I'm saying? It's <laughs> different. Than one, isn't it? I, I'm definitely not on that freestyle, man. Yeah, exactly. That freestyle is definitely not popping. I agree. The streets are saying that you love Brazilian stuff. Anyways, um, so the striker we know, we position. Know this one is <laughs> for the striker position. Watkins. Yeah, I got he's Watkins or Solanke, bro, for one of them two. I will pick one, Savage, please. All right. <laughs> just just one. I just need the one. All right, K Matt will go with you. One strike. What kings? Flawless. Isak. Quasi. Isak. Mike. Isak. You know. Steve. I actually got Watkins. Wow, I thought I actually thought you was gonna go. <laughs> it would have made sense. There have been friend. some poor games from Isak. There have been some poor games from Isak. I've no, seen no, more no. games from Isak than um no, than watching. And I hate Villa, so like yes. Um, Beto. Jesus. <laughs> now nah, go walk. Go walk, kids, bro. Go, go walk, kids, bro. Was that the Everton player? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the guy they signed from Shout out Carl Morris, more GNA than Bruno Fernandes. Hey, hey, Steve, 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 Steve. And James Madison, Steve, and James Steve, Madison. Steve, I included Madison Steve, and Robos Lai as well. Steve, so shout Steve, out Carl Morris. You're doing too much. Just, just, <laughs> yeah, <I'm laughs> doing too much. Let's just let G, let's just finish out the show, please. You So how many was that for Watkins? Was it K-Mac? Quasi, who did you say Watkins as well? He said. Oh, you said no, it's three. Two is three. Uh, it's three, 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 three. 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 And then oh, G. Oh, you're back. All right, back in the all right, one, all right G. All right, I'll go with. Hey, my Watkins been cooking, boy. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Savage politicking. <laughs> it's not just the goals, though, is it? It's the assists. He's provided. Yeah, nine, assists. 19 goals and 10 assists, bro. Just in the league. Crazy. Yeah, that's insane. You move like half a bank in the prime days. He's actually done no assists. Like, no assists. I don't mind that he hasn't got no assists, by the way. Like, that doesn't even factor. I don't either. Thing. Get the goals. Like, how I'd many rather you have zero assists. How many assists does Darwin have? Nine, I think. There you go. How many chances he missed? Oh, there we go. Yeah, that's a million. Million. And I feel like that's a bit of a low blow. We haven't even mentioned so, it. I don't. I don't even. I didn't want to get into it. English attack, man. Right? <laughs> I didn't. Yeah, English, the English attack, and we can't win nothing, bro. And we can't win nothing. Imagine that. We've got wow. four English players in here. Four, five English five. players. No, we got five. Five. Five English yeah, players. Although Ben White wants to punch up the coach every two minutes, and it's like. Bro, I guarantee wow. we'll see. He ain't going to the to the thing this nope. summer. Nah, nah. Walker's got that nope. laptop. Bench. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bench. Karma, I think he'll go, but he'll be on the bench. Watkins, bench. Gordon, bench. Foden, yep. potentially bench. Starts. So the reality is, England ain't winning nothing this this, this summer. Yeah, because it's yeah, you know, no, you know, you know, you know, to win nothing. The best English players outside, play outside of England. That's the problem. 
They'll continue to win nothing. They'll continue to win nothing for the rest of time. It's the gift that keeps on giving, like Arsenal, man. It's amazing. I've always, the thing is, I always wonder when I think about um when I think about England, even just looking at this team, because obviously we're just talking about this is just this season, right? In terms mm. of who's performed the best and who we think. And of course, like we said before, and I know people mentioned it, Declan Rice, of course, we could have put him in this potentially somewhere. So let's Saka. say we did put in Rice, Saka. Mm. Man, boy, listen, I swear to you, I'm not doing the beginning most of this season, Saka's been cooking. This is the last few months, bro. I, I wouldn't say he's been cooking though. No, no, when bro, I, when Arsenal couldn't I, get I, goals I, and that, it was all Saka, bro. It was all Saka. I, I agree. I agree. If Saka wasn't wasn't, I right swear to you, bro. I would have. I would have. Right. 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 You know what that sounds like? Yeah. That sounds like Salah. Right? Liverpool, when your attack ain't been cooking, Salah was still getting goals. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Agree. Yeah, but but exactly. So I don't feel like he was performing. I just no, think, I think he was performing. Goals. Remember when Arsenal were top of the table when it was like. You know, when it was three or four points and it was just them mm. at the beginning. That was because of the, the way they were playing. They weren't like an accident. They were cooking, bro. Yeah, it's just that, and, then, and then they couldn't make chances. And then there was that period after Christmas when they won like, they scored like 25 goals in like four games or some rubbish like that. Mashed everyone up. It was all soccer, bro. Mm. No, yeah, yeah. No, I'm sticking up for him. He's a bit of a loser still. He needs to go gym and that, bro. But yeah, man. You think Sancho can, Sancho can make the England squad? I hope so. Do I think who? No. Sancho, he's, not gonna, he's not going to make it. No, neither is Jamie by no gittens either, and that's fine. Let Jamie, let Jamie yeah, Bino. like, but you see, with them kind of players, like, you got you, like, we oh. remember, we've also got to remember, as Flawless said, first of all, it's Southgate, but secondly, there's a pecking order clearly in this team, so, so yeah. Yeah, like, Rashford different. will probably still just make it because he's Rashford. Like, Listen, as long, as long as Henderson's there, I don't care, right? so. I'm sorry, but if Henderson is I, in that squad, then I know. Why are you talking about Henderson's got his play? Yeah, Henderson is the first, in, first like, name on the list. Yeah, yeah, yeah. First class on the plane, blood. And Next. Calvin yeah. Phillips. And Calvin yeah. Phillips as well. And Maguire. They're all, no, they're no, no. Right. He can't even pick Calvin. Like, he, you know, when okay. if he picks Calvin Phillips, that's when I think even he will know. Like, okay, I can't even. <laughs> I actually can't even pick him. No, like, but he has tournament experience. He writes down the name and he's like, oh, shit, I can't do it. I got to race it back. Yeah, I got to race that shit. I can't. I can't. He's never let down, though. He's never let England down. I don't care if he's never let Jesus down. You know what's know what funny? Uh, I, know it's my, I know it's our own team and that, bro. But how come it's always like, Scouts not English until the England squad gets picked? Then all the Scouts are English. Get, you, know, you know like that. You know like that. Gordon and Trent are quiet when it comes to the England squad. Like, yo, all right. Bro, I'm not, like I said, I don't really want to get into them kind of debates because I love DMs going out the window. So, guys, that's obviously our Premier League team of the season. We've got Manager. Martinez in the Manager. Oh, yes, yes. Sorry, yeah, I forgot about that. Mm. Go on, then. Oh, K-Mac. Like. I didn't ask you to tell me first. I just said it, innit? Like... Manager. K-Mac. Um, <laughs> here I am, Emery. Flawless? Yeah, Emery. Quasi, if you're there, maybe he is. Mike, we'll go to you. I think Quasi. Oh, nine. Has to be. I feel like it's a unanimous but we'll Steve? Yeah, Unai. Yes. Well, he's gonna, he's gonna, he's gonna win his 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 standard European Cup as well, yeah. isn't he? Don't you find it <laughs> weird? No, he sorry, wins every year. <laughs> how every sorry, Savage actually. Before I continue. Well, Matt, Gary O'Neill. Shout out Gary O'Neill. It's close that, by the way. I, I was thinking about, I was thinking about that as well, by the way. That's, that's crazy how we've we've gone for not a manager who's of the top two, so we don't think that one of the top two have performed well enough. Also, also Ange, Ange was in in my thoughts as well because what he's done at Tottenham yeah. is just insane. Like an entire new team. squad. It's like, right. Yeah. yeah. It's yeah. Like, yeah. It's like, yeah. It's like, 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 Still ain't been a manager for that long, and yeah, I just think everyone's done a little bit, a little bit better. There's not, they're not done anything outstanding. It reminds me of uh, where's the man you win that 2013 won the league, innit? Mm-hmm. Is that the one when yeah. United fans are normally like, we didn't play that great, but we, we... no, nah, 2000. No, you're thinking of 2011 where we were like three, four away games from home. Yeah, you mean that's the Van Persie season? Yeah. No, was Van Persie? Uh, uh, no, 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 no. Yeah, that it, was this. Nah, Van well, last season. Well, it's Fergie's last season. McKay no, Durant. yeah. No, no, the last season, the season you're talking about where I remember yeah. where we didn't play well was the two, when we, the season we signed Ashley Young and we won like three away games from home. It was either that three season, or four. That's what, that's what yeah. the league feels like to me. I bet Newcastle away was one of them. I don't remember. I just remember we won the league. <laughs> 
True say we normally win there though. We got a good record there. So you know. Then, you know, normally get five. That then. Whenever, whenever Newcastle play Liverpool, I'm like, we're losing. I don't give a fuck. You could play twelve year olds and we losing. I, just... I mean, you're gonna lose if you play the twelve year olds. Regardless, <laughs> anyway, I feel. Yeah. But you see, when it you see when it comes to this season, what I find interesting is that you look at obviously all the all the teams who are in Europe. There's only one man standing. Mm-hmm. And it's the one, and, and it's the one who actually wins quite a few European. But do you, good. do you think that's because of the competition he's in? And I love the competition. I just about to say he's in the yeah. worst competition left, yeah. which is nah. But Leo, Leo, Leo played them very tough over the two legs. They, very tough. They did. That, that is not Only an easy. The leg. I didn't watch the first leg. Oh, Leo, you Leo, would tweet, slap, what, Leo would slap around Man United. They would beat Spurs over two legs. They would. Give Liverpool a good game, they would. I, Big man, I, we just lost at Atlanta, but they'll probably win. Bro, they will lost. That's not even a madness right now. You're right, you're right. But, but to be honest, I, I mean, doesn't that, that, doesn't that Jonathan Davis, Davis play for them? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Man. English, ballers, off, ballers. English snobbery has got everyone in shock, bro. But if you know about the other leagues, this ain't a shock, bro. Nope. Well, I was just about to say, sometimes we're around the Premier League and we don't win anything. City signed Doku from them as well. Yeah. No, it's not going to You're going to find gems. You're going to find gems in this league. Sometime next week, I will be doing a stream. Um, so I'll see if these guys are, of course, they're mm. available and free, where we'll be talking about um, all the all the leagues, like the top five leagues that, that I saw. When I saw the table, it's obviously Premier League, yeah. La Liga, Bundesliga, Syria, and uh, League yeah, I definitely want to have a conversation about it because I definitely think that that's something that, and this isn't based on this season, by the way. I don't want people to think, oh, because yeah. everyone's knocked out, that's why we're, no. no. I just want to really hear everyone's opinion on all the leagues because, as Savage just said, the snobbery in the Premier League snobbery. fan base is crazy. Like, And obviously, I know Mike, I know Steve, and everyone else, to be fair, but I know you guys especially, the way that you guys watch so much different football and some of the stuff I hear you guys say, I'm always like, it's crazy because other people, if they heard that or if they just don't know, they don't really take it as, oh, yeah, he's telling the truth. Or not even that, just even the fact that you don't even look at it as like, oh, yeah, that's true. Or Atalanta could do this. The reality is, maybe if we had actually watched a bit of Serie A this season, we might have known no. what they, you know what I mean? Like, when the draw would happened, be like, I, I, don't I, don't want them in it. I didn't want them in the draw. I thought we would win. Of course, on Liverpool, I think we're going to win yeah. the game. And that. But it's not, bro, it's not. If you don't watch the league, it's fine to just say, I, I don't watch the league, so I'm not sure exactly. what the team's like. Exactly. But just to say, like, oh, we'll smoke them. Because you checked your phone one day and there was losing to I don't know some other team that you never heard of, bro. Yeah. It's, cra- it's absolutely crazy. But then the, if you go look at the results of Champions Leagues and Europa Leagues and stuff like that, the way everyone talks is like England just been dominating con- consistently. Clean bro. sweeps. Uh, yeah. bro, it doesn't, it you think we win every competition every single year for like five yeah, years straight? It doesn't, it doesn't see, see, the last time England really dominated European football was the late seventies and early eighties. I think they yep. won seven or eight straight Champions Leagues, if I'm not mistaken. That's when England dominated European football. That's not the case now. Yeah, the England teams make the finals, but do they always win it? No. It's because awesome. people have a, you have a natural bias to what you watch the most of. Yeah, of course, yes, of course. And, and yeah, it's what most excites you and it. So if you, some people watch anime in Japanese, and some people watch it with the English dubs on it, and, it, and then when you hear the yeah. Japanese version, hey, what's Japanese, man? Like, oh, I, don't, I don't like how it sounds. I can't read the subtitles. But if you started watching it with that, you would be fine, bro. And that's yeah. what people do with football. I'm like, bro, it's a bit silly. The Prem might be the most exciting to you, especially if you're from England. As in, but usually it's all the VAR foolishness and all that. What's the exciting part, bro? It's yeah. not the football. The football's not exciting when everyone's just low blocking and that. Just talk off again, head in the ball yeah, away. And bend nah, some of the defensive the crazy, powers I've seen in the, in the Premier League has been horrible. The last seven, yeah. the last seven, the Champions crazy, League, the last seven Champions League finals, is three, three Real Madrid, one Bayern Munich, three English teams. Yeah, which one's the exciting crazy champion? Is as well. The, the crazy club, thing is, as well, with the Atalanta thing, is yeah. is we're probably going to get the the manager of the team that Atalanta knocked out before us. True. <laughs> True. <laughs> we should have done some homework on that. Yeah, we've been hammering lost to Atalanta. Yeah. <laughs> All four of those games, because yeah. they met in the group, all four of those games were like really, really good in their own right. Yeah, they're really equal. But it's also yeah. when you think about it, like obviously if we're looking at. Um, say um, came out. You just said there about Liverpool potentially getting Amarim. Look at the way that, and uh, you know, Savage. I'm always joking, calling the 
the Portuguese uh, Pep Guardiola <laughs> and stuff like that because of the way everyone talks about him. But when you think of it, I'm, I'm sitting there thinking, I know half of you, myself included, by the way, we don't watch that league enough to even have that type of, would I say, conversation in, in terms of me really sitting in saying, yeah, I really think he's going to be X, Y, and Z. I mean, I can only really base it off awesome. everything I've seen in the last year. Since, Tom's, since Tom mentioned him to me like last year, that's probably when I actually looked at him in general. And even bro, then, I'll be honest, bro. On the list. When man said Amaran to me, bro, all, all oh, I remember oh, is, oh. I remember him as a player, bro. As a player. I, just, yeah. I, just I don't even remember, remember him as a player. Nah, nah, bro, I, remember, I remember for, um, where yeah. was that? Where was the 2014 World Cup? Yeah, man, Brazil. 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 Well, he was in the Portugal yeah, squad, wasn't it? I swear yeah. he was in the Portugal squad. Yeah, no, midfield. He was. Yeah, yeah. I, I, I remember him. I, I, yeah, I remember him for Benfica. So I remember him as a footballer. And then, and then, as I told you the other day, I remember in lockdown when they played Spurs and they bossed him off the pitch. And I remember him in the press conference talking about when Manu were trying to get rid of Ronaldo. That's what. That's all I remember him as a manager. And I saw a few games, but apart from that, I only heard K Mac talk about him. Before the club was speaking about the thing, K Mac kept mentioning his name. I was like, I don't know who he's talking about, bro. And then when I realized it was the same guy. <laughs> I was like, okay. And I know that um, thingy Michael's been meant to talking about him properly. And that, but a lot of people, I don't know what this new thing is where people can't just say they don't know stuff. But you can just yeah, not know. Everyone because just you don't want to look silly. Let me do, let me do uh, everyone everyone, everyone an expert at everything, man. You should know that, Savage. Yeah, yeah, everyone exactly. an expert at everything. Mm. People don't know, people really don't know what they don't know. People rarely don't know what they don't know. The biggest know. problem you have is if you say that to me, bro, but I'm not trying to like call people out. I just want to know. So I'm going to call you bluff and ask you questions, isn't it? and then all of a sudden, <laughs> Man of spamming Google and that to try and find out stuff I asked instead of just telling me. Just, just, yeah, it's not that serious. Okay to say. Yeah, that's what he mentioned. Hey, that's why you got the likes of Steve. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, that's yeah, why like, I worked you know, with like, Steve. You know, like Andre, who was linked to Liverpool, now no one cares about him. Remember oh that? my yeah, god, yeah, don't yeah. even get me started, bro. Like, I don't even hear his name anymore. For like, was in terms Brazil, of was that the Brazilian yes, field? Bro, the one who's all yeah, of a sudden yeah, not yeah, good anymore. He's not. He's not. He's not going to be world class anymore. No one cares about him, bro. Yeah, no one cares. But that. But that. But for I think I was saying this to you yesterday, Savvy. For all I know. <laughs> in Brazil, obviously, I don't know because I don't watch the yeah. Brazilian league. But for all I know, he's one of the better midfielders in that league, and yeah, yeah. he can still easily become the player that we all kind of thought of, you of know, course. that he would be. You know, so listen, man, it's it's silly, man, it's silly, it's silly. But guys, we're gonna end it here. And um, I just like to say thank you to the panel um, for joining me um, this evening. As I mentioned yeah, before, all of their um, channels are all on my featured channel list. Do not ask me where it is on YouTube. It's there somewhere. You will be able to find it. I'm not going to waste my time doing that. I feel like you guys can obviously do that. I'll quickly go around the room just for, to let you guys know when this stream does end, it will be redirect you straight to um, this evening stream where I'll be um, on, on Sarcasm City TV uh, with Flawless doing the Man United and Liverpool podcast show. K-Mac, let the people know where they can find you and what you got coming up, man. Uh, big up! You can um, catch me, Kmart Channel. Um, I normally do shows with uh, Jamie Phillips and Quasi as well, um, and mm -hmm. obviously yourself and Endsman as well. Uh, big up everyone! Just Kmart plugged himself with zero enthusiasm. Listen, man, I needed some. Nah, don't do that, man. Your season just ended. Uh, of course, he's disappointed, man. I hate, that's what it is. I, I, yeah, that's what it is. I hate doing that oh, stuff. Oh, oh, I hate self. What was it self flagellation? Is it something like that? <laughs> That's promotion, self promotion, self promotion. Self -promotion. That's what you're looking for. Flawless. They already know it, people, but let people know. G already mentioned it. Sarcasm City TV. So make sure you subscribe. We live every day, people. There will be the United Liverpool show, 11 p.m. So just over an hour from now. And mm -hmm. obviously, NBA playoffs is starting. Well, it's pl the final Come playing on. game, but NBA playoffs yeah. is coming up. Come make on. sure you get over to the playback, people. That is the playback. If you have an NBA league pass, you can watch along with us. If you get over there, I've given out some VIP uh, passes as well, so you can watch along with us on the same okay, stream cool. at the same time. So yeah, Savage, yeah. if you tap in, or any of you man on here tap in, just let me know and I'll give you. I'm, 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 yeah, I'm man, you already know. Yeah, man, if any, yeah, yeah, you already know. Sixteen out of ten. If any of you man join <laughs> the playback, I'll send you the. I'll just click you in, and then you'll be able to watch the game on the screen with us as well. Oh, so we'll all be I synced don't. up. So NBA playoffs. So playback that is dot TV slash Sarcasm City TV or download the app. From your store, but G, big up for having me. Big up to the panel. Oh. Probably enjoyed this. Big up. Nah, every time. Also, but uh, um, Flawless didn't actually mention. If you guys are looking for your sixteen out of ten um, t-shirts, they are on sale on. at this current That's moment it. in time. Could you yeah. let them know? You the actually price? made. You actually made. Yes, sixteen out of ten t-shirts. Yes, people. Sarcasm. Yes, I did. Of course, man. Sarcasmcitv.myshopify.com. That is sarcasmcitv. Uh... 
www.myshopify.com people it's two different designs four different colors only available currently for UK shipping. 22nd of April, it will be worldwide shipping. Uh, you got to make that like... worldwide, Paulus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 22nd of April. That's what I just said. 22nd of April. I've got you lot. Worldwide, it will be available. And you already know, at the great price of £16.10. pence. But this is a this limited is time only. You know. Limited <laughs> time only. Yeah, nah, that's passed only for current members, if you're a member by the 16th. Uh... But yeah, people... Go get your teas. We only the shop will only be open till the sixteenth of May, ten PM. So get your teas in now, people. Yo, man, teas in. Flawless is the worst, you know. Oh my god. No, that That's is great game. marketing. You already god, know, man. That's... You got you got to strike by the iron's hot, man. You gotta be opportunist. No, 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 listen, I, so the teas are there, the people. Highest, I give it the highest of respect. Quasi, let the people know man, where they can find uh, it. Um, yeah, big up to all men, them on the channel and the panel. Yeah. Appreciate all you guys. I don't know why Flawless is talking about NBA, Golden State, no in it, so I'm not watching any. Oh, uh, you know, now nah, come enjoy it. Regardless, yeah. join up to the playback. Go, you can, yeah, you got, you, uh, you're a Golden State fan, so I know you hate the Lakers. They're about to get swept. There you go. So the yeah. Lakers, no, nah, come game. watch. There you go. Okay, I want to hit the Lakers head along. I'll do the head. There we go. Oh, yes. man, we'll be there. Pull up. I got you. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> uh, but yeah, you'll find me on Crazy Bowl TV. I'll be on after the game on Sunday. So come through. Um, come check us out. Bada bing, bada boom. Mikey Mike. Chat to the people, man. Where can they find you? And what have you got coming up? By the way, I love his... Um, you guys need to watch, man. His his reactions to the UCL games and stuff like that. Nice. Like when you're going... You, you, know, you know what I love the most? is how you pronounce the names. I'm always like, okay, so that's how you pronounce his name. So I start, you know, just writing it down mentally. Which, which, like, which name was it this time? It was the name you said um, for Dortmund. I can't remember the names, uh, the player's name. Nicole Spokum. Spokum. No, 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 no. It wasn't Zabitzer. Zabitzer, yeah. Julian no, Brandt? I said Sabitzer. Not him. No, it wasn't someone was obvious. Fire. It wasn't like someone obvious like that. Is it, is it Zali Odjan? No. Ian Matson, it might, yeah, yeah. I think Madsen. it might, yeah, because I think Madsen. I always just say, "Oh, Ian Matson." Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. But Ian Madsen. Madsen. Ian Madsen. <laughs> I'm so English and fresh. You know what? You know what's the most difficult one? The most difficult one is you guys, the sporting striker, because I know a lot of uh, English people say Victor Jirkeres. I know it. I know it. I know it's it. not Victor. Okay, it's, it's Victor. It's Victor, Victor Jirkeres. It's a very difficult Victor, name, Victor Jirkeres. Yes, but it's Jirkeres. Yeah, it's very I'm with it. I'm with it. I'm with it. Now, see, that's what my channel Yeah, dude, that's what it is, man. We're like baby America, man. Just snobbish, bro. Like, no one cares. Hey, do not put me in that snobbish category. I am trying to, you know, further my. How many times I've tried to say a footballer's name in front of my missus and she just looks at me like, that's not how you say his name? Go say Ali Gunnar Sosa in front of my missus and see what she does, bro. The look she gives me, bro, he said, that's not what it says. Like, oh. Well, that's what everyone's been saying for the last 30 years, blood. You want me to do? Yeah, <laughs> no, no, but this is what happens, Shane, when you visit Michael Talks Football Channel. You get football, you get entertainment, and you get a history lesson and language lessons. I mean, that's I can, what I'm saying, I can I'm speak, to I can speak, th I can somewhat speak three languages, somewhat. I'm not like Aaron Sakai. I mean, Aaron, that guy's speaking like eight languages. Oh, yeah, that's my brother. Like yeah, that, yeah, like, yeah. Aaron, Aaron is a beast at that, he, but he, he, he I try my best. Man. Nah, he's oh, ridiculous. Yeah, yeah. But, yeah, yeah, Aaron's yeah. my bro. He, he a beast. He, he speaks more nah, languages Aaron. than Arsenal have won knockout ties in Europe in their history. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He a beast. 100%. Damn. Hey, by, the way, by, the, by the way, you know what's the greatest stat of the week? Eric Dyer has been to more Champions League semifinals than Arsenal as a club. And I will <laughs> and I will continue promoting my channel by saying you can visit Michael Talks Football Channel, doing the previews for the Copa America. I'm previewing every nation. Just did Peru, Chile. And I'm also doing it for the Euros. Got Switzerland coming out tomorrow or Sunday. And mm. then obviously doing the Champions League content, Europa League content, even though Liverpool are out, but screw them. I can still talk about Marseille right. and the, the wonderful team they got and the Conference League because it's a madness in the Conference League, bro. I, I'm begging. I'm begging Mike, you're better tonight. than that. It's not Marseille. It's Olympique de Marseille. Uh, Olympique de Marseille. Yeah. But Olympique. I'm just begging that one of Chelsea or Man United play in the Conference League. That would bring nothing more joy to me than seeing Man United play at the Gibraltar Rock. Nothing more joy. As long as you win the trophy, I don't care. Go pick up that shit. <laughs> that's, <laughs> that's true. That's true. <laughs> so, yeah, you, can you, know, to you know that. You know if Manchester United played in that competition next season. If you oh. do not win it, the banter would reach stupid levels. Bro. Oh, I'll burn everything to the ground if we're in it and don't win it. 
Better have I guarantee you, you, like, you won't though, then. Wallace. It's crazy. Just yeah, like I don't, think, I don't think they would. I don't even think they would. You, just like how you could guarantee Arsenal failure, I could get yeah. you. Guarantee yeah, United failure. Yeah. Yeah. Subscribe and like a Fox football channel. And of course, we will be there for the hate along of the Lakers as the, my Nuggets will sweep those bums. They will sweep oh, those bums fine. again. Oh, yeah, you're about to yeah, sweep yeah. Them. yeah. He's about to eat, man. Fucking nice. I'm, you know, I'm tuning in this evening actually to the, to the NBA. Hey, know, G, where's your Warriors at? So, Steve, um, would you like to promote your channel? Um, where can we find you? And, is Clay yeah. working at Dunkin' Donuts now, bro? That guy's just throwing up donuts. <laughs> um, Michael, Steve hell. is trying to talk and promote his channel. Do you mind, you know, not just interrupting him? Jesus. <laughs> so, sorry, Steve. Sorry, Steve. Nah, that's all right. I got a stacked deck tomorrow. Watch alongs. I've got one, two, three, four, five. About to schedule the fifth one. Uh, Set to Vigo, Las Palmas, 8 a.m. Uh, FC Nantes versus Star René, the Derby de, Ber uh, de la Bretagne. Uh, Saint Etienne versus Girondin de Bordeaux. That's at one o'clock, and then uh, Mon uh, Montreal versus Orlando City in MLS. And there's gonna be one scheduled in there somewhere, probably the Cadiz game, Cadiz uh, Girona. So that's what I got going on. Really. So, Boom, yeah. guys, you heard it here first. You heard it first. And Savage, the main man. Yeah, Chat to the people, man. That's By the way, before I, I'll say it so that he doesn't even have to say it. Here's his <laughs> channel right here. No muggles. No yeah, tampon bro. boys yeah, on bro. to the channel, but go on. All right, that's sorry. my guy, brother. No mud bloods either, brother. You can't be yeah, sorry, no blood, blood, blood. but yeah, man. Um, I got no football content coming up because yeah, man, it's depressing still. But um, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You think ends can just go on holiday and leave me, blood? No, blood. I'm having a holiday. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Ends left before shit hit the fan, boy. He's like, bro, yeah, he, bro, he went so quick, bro. But um, yeah, what's gonna what, happen? What, what, Saturday? Yeah. Oh, uh, WWE SmackDown content coming up. That'll be in the next few hours. Um, cool. And then apart from that, man, I've been trying to break into a couple of flat earth groups and that. That's why I'm not, bruv. I've been kicked out the fourth one. Yeah, bruv, I got kicked out of Christians against um, dinosaurs, bruv. They're not having it. So I'm gonna Christ, wait, Christians them. against... Never mind. It's a you serious Facebook group, bruv. They mean business. They told me... I, 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 I don't even want to know. It's only that. It's only that. I'm trying to be... I'm trying to be informed. With current events. Yeah, you're yeah, trying to be informed I, about Christians versus dinosaurs. That is the rivalry you want yeah. really to know all about. Yeah, 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 yeah. Got it, Steve. Yeah. Just got it. Um, honesty was asking uh, this. Honesty, make sure you head on over to Sarcasm City TV. <clears throat> uh, to the job. When we get over there. I'm not saying the Bayern job is going for. He's been linked I, honestly, to I don't, I don't know, know about him. Yeah. What's this? Hey, what's, the, what's the source to this? That's what I want to say. Is a reliable source said this. <clears throat> Very good. To be fair, honesty doesn't just post stuff out of yeah. nothing, but honesty, if you have got the source, of course, if you're still here, uh, let man know. Uh, people at Liverpool admire Jamal Muziala. If I don't see go them, on Fabio's page, hey, bro. I admire Shapiro. I ain't going to touch it. I admire Alex Morgan. Like, you, know, the, you know the favourite one in the summer? Liverpool are looking at, like everyone's looking at that player. <laughs> like everyone's looking, looking at, at you know, like that, bro. Yeah. You know, Fabrizio recently, he's been mo moving a bit weird. I can't lie. He's been moving. I a saw bit. something he's about been, him recently. He's always as well, been a weirdo. He's always been. He's, he's a bit of a weirdo. <laughs> now. Always. I, I saw something about him floating around online. You know what? He used day. to be. He yeah. used to be the guy for the streets, but now he's just the yeah. corporate man. Yes. Yes. He's a guy sports so he's kind of like Drake. So he's Fabrizio turned into Drake. I feel like Drake is getting you know attacked for no damn reason. I, I don't know. Money will make you do that, Stu. Yeah, that's yeah. right, Savage. I told you, man, already, bro. If somebody, if some big company out, sends me a check for YouTube, I'm selling out, blood. But you, man, don't ask me on the channel, nothing. Let them on. Hey, I don't blame you one bit. I send you like a WhatsApp message, but you won't see me on stream again. Me <laughs> <laughs> Savage doing selling pizzas online or side. I'm like, right. I've yeah, been trying hey, to get hey, them hey, big get contracts, bro. I'll talk shit all day, bro. But as soon as someone gets in touch with me, I'm gone. Blood. I don't know. Yeah, get the bag, man. <laughs> same. I hear that. Yo, Savage, I'm on the same wavelength. Yeah, bro. Like, hey, the contact... you said just for the people, I was. No, I was yeah, 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 I, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I said I was for the people. Now I'm for a person, and that yeah, person yeah. is well, you know, well, it's, me. Well, it's a shame that no one pays you large sums of money to not watch Man United. You know? Yeah, for real. You know what I was I wish. I, I wish. Yeah. Nah, you, <laughs> it's a shame. He's flipping sellouts, guys. Make sure you hit the like button. <laughs> Make sure you share and subscribe to the channel. G, Flawless, Steve, K-Mac, Mike, Savage, love for jumping in. We out.